Hello? Are we good? Are we all good? Are we all situated? Am I situ- I'm situated. Are we situated? Is chat still here? I hope chat is still here. I adjusted my camera a little bit, so we have a little bit of a lower angle. I don't know if I'm gonna like it or not. Don't know. Um, fix my stream quality settings. I don't know if it's good or not either, but I mean, I guess we'll find out. Something about this camera angle isn't tickling my pickle. Maybe I'll change it. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. You'll see the clarity. Is it good? Does it look better? I hope it does. I hope the stream looks a little bit nicer now. Oh, all right, okay. I'm, I feel so bad. I baited everyone on Instagram and stuff and I was like, hey guys, I'm streaming. Haha, <laughs> psych, I'm actually not. I'm ending my stream immediately so I can adjust my settings. <laughs> I feel super bad, but you know what? It is what it is. Okay, you know what? Actually, I don't, I don't know. Do I like this camera angle? Is this a good camera angle? Do we like this? I don't actually know if I do or not. How do we, how do we feel? Hmm. Let's see. Actually, you know what? It's not too bad. I'm just overanalyzing it because I'm insecure. But I'm gonna stretch this out a little bit more. And I think I have more elbow grease now. All right, cool beans. Cool, 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 cool. Hi, Zany boy, what's up? I'm gonna take my meds real quick, AKA just Advil to deal with my little headache because I forgot to do that. Because I'm a professional streamer. Okay. What were we doing in this game again? Oh yeah, we have to go summon uh, Rail Spellgar, right? Mm -mm -mm. I am Caleb G. Shira. I know. Thank you, Bard. Genesis, thank you so much for using your prime on me. I really appreciate it. Where are the ears? I'm getting them. Don't worry. Thank you for lurking. Hi, Jay. I'll join back in later. Have a good stream. Thanks, Brandon. Have a good one. Dragon time? Yeah, it's dragon time. All right, hold on. God, what if I did my hairstyle just like hers? Hold on. So I have to have a little bit of my hair flip like this. I've got to have the little floopy. And then... Water out of Syrah's shaker tastes or hit different. I know, right? Thank you for gifting a community sub, Brandon. I appreciate it. Thank you. Sorry, you are literally my crush. Good. I don't trust anyone that doesn't have a crush on me. How can you not? <laughs> okay, let's see. Is that a signature science food shaker that you're drinking out of? Very cool. It is. Oh, wow. Bo Josh Horseman, thank you for the four month resub. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Just saying, I'm just sharing the story. <laughs> Take sips from my Syrah X Advanced Beauty Shaker. Don't mind me. Wow. You have great taste in shakers, honey. Okay. I think we're actually chilling. I think we're chilling. I think this is good. Do we like this? Welcome back. Thank you, Fascinated with Fire. Appreciate it. I think this is this is pretty solid for now. My friend is gonna come over on the weekend and we're gonna put up um, some curtains in here. That way I can make my stream room a little bit more moody, get my colors actually looking colorful in the back and not like washed out. Excited for it. That being said though, let me reapply my lipstick and get into the game. Thomas, hello, I am good. I am great. I am chilling. I am vibing. And I'm ready to play my Final Fantasy Online. Alrighty. Alrighty, ready, 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 ready. Alrighty, ready, 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 ready. Okay, it's dragon time, baby. Never mind, we are in a queue. <laughs> Hi, Redman, what's up? What did everybody get up to while I was gone? Oh, I'm honestly really enjoying streaming at like a little earlier hour, to be honest. It feels 
right. I don't know. Akil, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. I appreciate it. To everybody that just got gifted a sub, welcome to the coven. I hope you're a badger months and your stay. She don't miss. I don't miss, baby. I do not. How are you, Sean? What's up? How are you doing? Hold on. Let me open up my IKEA lights real quick. I hope they're on. Let's see. Let's see. What moody color do we put? We'll put pink. Red? Maybe I'll put yellow for now? Nah, we'll just put it to pink. Alright. Okay, we're in the game. Sarnix promote you to leader? Sarnix is still in my party? Why are they still in my party? Okay, anyways. Uh, waiting for the wind to change. Oh, let me switch to my streamer HUD. Hold up. There we go. Alright. Man, it's so goddamn big. <laughs> streamer HUD. Oh, I know what to do. I'm gonna bring a scenario guide down here like that. Yeah. Yeah, I think that that looks good. That way my advertisements at the top can run and they're not clashing. Look at me being a professional. Hell yeah. All right. Your, your Euro friends appreciate the early streams. No pressure though. Yeah, I know. I know. I definitely want to stream earlier, like basically for them. Because I do feel really bad when all of my Euro viewers and stuff get to like miss out on everything. Okay, hold on. Let me just, there we go. Are we doing hype train? Well, I mean, we could be. We could be. We could be. What are we? We're on our way to level two? Do you think we can hit level two, y'all? I don't think we can. I don't know, chat. Oh. Hi, Atka. Yes, I am back. I am back with more Final Fantasy. Honestly, I have a really bad feeling I'm going to be binge playing this game for the next long while on Twitch. And so, honestly, you know what? I hope everybody is okay with that. You will not be able to escape me or Final Fantasy Online. I spent like three months watching Preach work through the main story quest. I got up early enough exactly once to watch a Euro stream. Just watch the VODs the rest of the time. A plus would recommend. Good lord. Good lord. You are dedicated. Could not be me. Wait, Vosk, whereabouts are you from? I don't remember. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Killing these guys are kind of fun. I like <laughs> enemies that are like a mild challenge. Not that they're like really a challenge per se, but like just beefier, you know? Ah, you're from Missouri. Misery. Okay, okay. I'm gonna turn up the game a little bit for me. Jay, thank you for the hydration. I appreciate it. What's up, Magic Maiku? How are you? Honestly, I love watching people play through the Final Fantasy online story. I will happily watch Yelva Elfman for a long time. Fuck yeah. Well, you're stuck with me then. Oh shit, my bad. Oh shit, oh fuck, oh fuck, I'm fucking up, I'm fucking up. I'm fucking up, I'm fucking up, I'm fucking up. I'm fucking up, I'm fucking up, I'm fucking up. I did it. Yeah! To the west of Alfino's location and then to the east, right? Yes. So now I gotta go over here to protect Mr. Alfie. No, get away! Get away, get away! Get away, get away! Get away, get away. Hell yeah. I love having no cooldown. <laughs> Take that, bitch. All right. 
How how is T Biggs? Who is T Biggs? Who who is T Biggs? Who is T Biggs? What is T Biggs? How is T Biggs? Okay, where do we go? We go up here. Do I go up here or do I go up here? I think I go up here. Gonna rock hop. Ooh, can I rock hop? Yeah. Caleb! Caleb, baby, thank you for the three gifted subs. Oh my god, you're at 70 now. I appreciate you. Stormcrow got in there. Nice. We love to see it. We love to see it. Thank you. Caleb, how are you, my sweet bean? How are you doing today? Alright, now let's go back to the team. If you would have gifted two, you could have had had it at 69. I know. Missed opportunity. It's hot out, so I'm tired and sweaty. Ew. Caleb, if you poured your sweat into a bottle, like into a jar, I would drink it. I would drink it. What do you think Mikote sweats uh, taste like? What do you think Horshafant's t uh, <laughs> sweat tastes like? I would assume salt. <laughs> and I'm eating noodles? Oh, hell yeah. Eat them nudes. I'm so tempted to get more ramen, but I know it'll knock me out again. <laughs> Package it like a Capri Sun? Exactly. See, you fucking get me. All right, Estinian, what's up? I see I was right to worry about the boy's safety. Once Alfino returns from the, with the wood, we can see about supper. All right, hold on. I gotta open my stream real quick. I just gotta see and make sure that the quality is a-OK -okay, because I boosted my statistics. Oh, I think it's OK. Oh, is it vibing? I think so. Uh, the Ice Queen has filled a pot with what looks like stew ingredients ready for the fire. <gasps> Dinner time. Is this Dinian just sitting on a bat? Yeah. <gasps> Hello, Alfie. No. Oh, Pepper, you're so cute. Oh! Tiyomogo. <laughs> ah, few things compared to the simple pleasure of sitting beside a crackling campfire of one's own making. Ha! So speaks a great explorer. Until recently, you wouldn't have recognized firewood if it came with kindling and a flint. It says, well, you instructed me so patiently then. But yes, left to my own devices, I would have been compelled to signal to you sail with a pile of damp leaves. I was born the pampered son of Charlayan dignitary, dignitary, and alongside my twin, became the youngest student ever to be accepted into the studium. How proud I was to match wits with scholars and philosophers. How ignorant of mine own shortcomings that hubris invited manipulation and betrayal and led to the downfall of the scions. We all of, we all of us are guilty of similar ignorance. How many men lay down their lives, never knowing what it is that they fight for, never questioning that which they have been taught to believe? It's emotional. It was only upon meeting Hersvelgar that I learned the truth hidden within our story. Were it not for that chance encounter, I would never have vowed to tear down the Holy See and expunge the falsehoods with which it fans the flames of conflict. I would have lived and died in ignorance. That the truth has driven me to, the ter to do terrible things, I cannot deny. But I would rather sin in the pursuit of peace than imagine myself virtuous for perpetuating a needless war. 
If this journey has taught me anything, it is the importance and difficulty of holding to one's convictions in the face of failure, of striving always to replace one's ignorance with knowledge. You are all well on your way, Master Alf, you know. At your age, I was but a fool swinging a spear with scarcely a thought in my head. Even now, I struggle to acknowledge the misconceptions under which I have labored. Sitting here amongst these grand ruins, how can I deny that man and dragon once lived in peace? But for all that such an age existed, we are now in a time of war. Nidhogg killed my family, and no quirk of history will exonerate him. I may be ignorant of how the Dragon Song War began, but if we do not put an end to this conflict now, I can say for a certainty that it will only breed more vengeful souls such as mine. In my hands resides the power to vanquish a great worm. If Ishgard's survival rests on me wielding that power, I will slay Nidhogg myself. Hoarders or no. Oof. Estinian, you gave your word! My word is contingent upon the success of our parley. Show me the strength of your convictions, Lady Iceheart. Convince Harris Velgar of the righteousness of your cause. Doubt not, but that I shall, Dragoon. Well, winds willing, we shall have our answers on the morrow. Let us sleep now and face our fate with the rising, s rising of the sun. What a cute little cutscene. Well, I mean, sweet, rather. I think sweet is the right word for it. Alright, stream looks like it's in good hands. We're good. Sarah ASMR channel when? Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, I, bu I literally bought these, remember? <laughs> I literally fucking bought these. Well. I get the silver pieces. That's one of my favorite scenes of the whole game. It's a pretty good one. I really enjoyed it. Remember the game with Nidhogg in it called Nidhogg? No. Conversations beside the campfire are so important in RPG slash fantasies. I agree. I'm very excited for the next campfire scene that we have um, in my D&D session. So far we've just been like hopping from tavern to tavern and it's fun, but like tavern, like tavern, um, We've been having like tavern sittings and inn sittings, but we need that that campfire scene again. We need another campfire scene. The last campfire um, setting we had, um, that I think is when my character started opening up to some of the other characters, which was really nice. Yeah, I prefer the RP over the combat, truthfully. I do need the intimacy gonna end up cutting the lights off in the room letting Sarah read me Final Fantasy lore until I fall asleep. I got you, baby! Alright. Moghan is gazing meaningfully at the path to Zenith. The campfire was so cozy. I must have fallen asleep, Kupo. You did! But do you feel how the winds have shifted? They will have borne Horace Velgar back to the skies above Zenith. I'm sure of it. Holy shit. What the fuck is that over there? This is your chance to climb to the highest floor of the palace and summon him with a toot on that shiny horn. So, uh, I'll be heading back now, if it's all the same to you. Good luck, Koopo! It was nice knowing you! Can we get some Moogle waves in the chat? Say bye-bye, y'all. <laughs> Alright. Oh, fuck! Oh my god. <laughs> that scared me. Is that Dini in person or about some other people on Discord? If you use Discord, you should check out Tailspire. We use it for a campaign I'm playing through and the map building mechanic for it is insane. So I've heard- oh shit. So I've heard of Tailspire. Um, we just use Rule 20. Currently we're playing over Discord, unfortunately. We haven't been able to have a real life session in a long time. Like, I haven't been able to have a real life session in a long time. Um, so a bunch of my friends just get together and play online. It's nice. Hi Lonely, what's up? 
Can't wait to also have a campfire scene where I accidentally roll a one on acrobatics. Fall to the fire! Caleb, no! Void is doing well. Oh my god, do we want a void update? So, Void is starting to break down a little bit. I think she's starting to accept her emotions and find a little bit more comfort in some of the people around her, which is really good. She's finally getting a little bit of that character development that we've been looking for. Um, she... A lot of the party members now, or well, three of the party members now, are in some way connected to a god. And it's been posing the question of why do our weapons, or like why do we have a connection to God? And as we all know, Void is a warlock and her patron is this evil, well not evil, but this like, um, malevolent uh, deity named Iris. She's um, represented by the snake and Void, we went into a library. Um, and she asked one of her companions, Hey, can you help me look for some books? I don't really want to ask anybody else to help me. I really don't want other our other companions to hear me either. Um, I, I, they already think ill of me. I don't need to... I don't want them to come to any conclusions because of this. So they go to look for... And th so they find out... Um, he asks the librarian, like, Hey, um, what's in here? Blah, 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 blah. And she tells him about this, like this door that she can't unlock so we go to check it out void is able to unlock it it there's an arcanic presence to it and then as she approaches it she puts her hand on the knob which is like the eye of a snake and her snake that she has on her hand slithers off of her and like unlocks the door so tldr she meets her patron and her patron tells her you don't have to murder anybody anymore you don't have to kill anyone anymore but you have to collect more followers for me because, unfortunately, you're the only one that's left and my people are getting picked off. And Void's not too happy about this. She's happy that she doesn't have to kill anymore, but she doesn't want to um, to do any more of Iris's bidding. But she can't say no. She can't resist. She owes Iris her entire life. Um, and, yeah. So, Void is... And... and um, I don't think Void heard, but I overheard, because I was in the call, um, that companion that she was with, uh, he was asking the librarian if there, if she knew any way to, um, unbind a warlock from their patron. So I think we might be going down a few interesting routes now in the campaign, which I am very excited to explore. Maybe Void is going to become a big bad. Maybe Void is going to unbind from her patron. Maybe, I don't know, maybe Void is going to start murdering her companions? Who knows? I don't know. We'll see what happens. But I'm I'm, I'm very happy for her. Um, there were a lot of really funny moments too. <laughs> she, um... <laughs> Well, I can't really talk about any of them because none of them would really make sense, I guess. Um, she got really drunk and one of the companions that she has like a rivalry with, which is that same guy, um, as she was drunk and came back into the inn, she saw him- is he in here? Hold on, is Jay in here? He's not, okay. Um, he was loitering in the inn and she was like, oh, do you want to go sleep in my room? Like, you look tired, it's 2 a.m., here you go. Well, no, she didn't even give him the key. She, like, popped out her hips so the, her, sa like, her satchel, her uh, bag of holding would, um, like, go into his direction. And she makes him open it so he can dig around in it to grab the key, finds the key, and then they share the room for the night, but they're in separate beds. This is the first time that his character has ever slept in. Like, uh, he's always the first one up. Not this time. Um, and he... <laughs> We, we, someone raps at our door and he's in his bed, I'm in mine, he's shirtless, Void is nude underneath a, underneath a cloak, because that's all she had at the time. And so he goes to open the door and he's all like disheveled and topless and she's like disheveled and like in her cloak and her companions are like, oh! <laughs> and she's like, no! <laughs> it was, it was hilarious. It was a it was a really good session for all the characters. I think we all had like really good moments and I just know that shit's about to hit the fan again. Hi Rhea! 
scandalous. Good times, good times. It was it was fun. I wish um honestly I would love to I know like we're doing that campaign for shits and giggles and for fun and it's it's a long campaign, so it's not gonna end until next year. But um or we're assuming next year. But um I really wish that we could like stream it or we could do like recordings. I would love to to share that campaign with everybody. It's it's really good. It's really fun. I love my companions. Like I love my friends that um, I'm doing it with. It's a very comforting group of people and I feel very safe and I and they give me the space to be vulnerable with my character, which is really nice. Yeah, Void is a tiefling. Here, let me show you her. Let me show you her. Hold up. One sec. I just wanted to make sure that I got the right monitor on the screen. There she is. That's my baby! This is Miss Void. She is my tiefling warlock baby. She is tech she's a warlock, but she is not really skilled with her magic. She is an assassin. I haven't had her use her dagger in a while because of the enemies that we've been like going up against, but that's what she's best at. She's best at interrogation. She's really good at stealth things like, like being um like stealthy and um murder. <laughs> Yeah, Ricky is fucking amazing. This is my second commission from her. She did my Dragon Age OC as well. I'm sure I can find it somewhere. Oh, don't get me banned. Don't get me banned. Don't get me banned. Don't get me banned. There we go. Yeah, she's really good. I love commissioning her. I'd watch this Netflix, Netflix series. Same. I would fuck it to you. My Eldritch Pack Warlock is currently playing the... The long con with his patron being buddy buddy, but plans to entomb his patron, hopefully sealing him away or entomb his page his patron, hopefully sealing him away for the greater good. Ooh, I like that. I like that. I'm looking respectfully. Yeah, they're both really hot. Yeah, Ricky's really good. I'm gonna commission her again for something. I'm gonna commission her two more times. Three more times, actually. I have three more comms that I want. I wanna get Pepper. Um I really wanna get Pepper from her. I want to get one of me, like just me, um, and then there's a third one that I can't actually talk about yet because it's a secret, and she actually can't even know about it yet either, so that's the that's the funky part because uh, it has to do with our D&D &D sessions. I'm an artist, and I illustrate characters for all of my players. Can I draw her? Which one? Do you want to draw Void, or do you want to draw um, Rayanera? Oh god, stopped on my- don't ban me, don't ban me, don't ban me. <laughs> Which one do you want to draw? Which one of my babies? Pepper the Mint! Pepper the Mint! I'm convinced every D&D adventure is basically a is in Every D&D adventure is, is incredibly attractive? You're right. Been reading a decent amount of Vampire the Masquerade lore recently, and luckily I'm tempted to either run or play- DO IT! Yeah, Twitter roulette, I know I'm brave. You pick? So I love getting artwork of Rayanera. Rayanera is my child. She is me. But I have so much of her. But honestly, do void. Give me some void. Draw my baby. Um, the artist is Hayliz. So H-A-I-L-I-I-Z. She is chef's kiss. Her information, I believe, is on my Twitter. Like right here. Yeah, there you go. So I'll just pay, post her in chat. Definitely go support her. She is fucking amazing. What is this? Jay just sent me something. He said he saw this on stream and now I have to as well. Do I have to open it on stream? Story time! Alright, never told anyone this, but I guess fuck it. Here goes. Alright, chat, you ready? Be me. It was green text, by the way. Be me. 23. Finally move out and start life with girlfriend. Small apartment. Pretty nice. We fucked a lot, but she didn't like anything nasty. Just fucking in hell. Okay, hold on. I can't, I can't read this. <laughs> I'm 
haven't posted this. I'm <laughs> I'm posting this on my Discord server. Actually, fuck it. I'm reading it out loud. I'm bold. All right. I ask if I can titty fuck her one night. We're both ass naked. She agrees. I get on top of her and she, they, they do the thing. Man, that was fucking awesome. She stays quiet. Ask her what's wrong. She's still quiet. Turn around and look at her. She has a dead stare at her stomach. I look. I left a giant skid mark from my ass thrusting. I tell her I'm so sorry and I didn't know. She gets her clothes and leaves. Didn't see her for about a week. She broke up with me. <laughs> oh, oh my god. <coughs> oh my god, I'm posting it in memes in my server. Gotcha guys, don't worry. Holy shit, that's funny. Wash your damn ass. Wash your ass, boy! God damn it, that is nasty! <laughs> you know, what wipe their ass gets taken out of the gene pool. Amen. I was telling chat earlier. Sometimes I don't even wash. I don't even. I don't even wipe my ass. I go straight into the shower and wash that shit. Fosk, I know that ain't you. Yeah, that's a random person. Okay. Anytime I see someone idling in the distance, I always just assume it's Vosk. <laughs> Can't change your name move states, literally. Absolutely. Alrighty. Oh, I just noticed Sarnix finally left my party. I wonder what they were doing. <sighs> based opinions, babes. Based opinions. So I'm glad I could share that with everybody. I hope you all enjoyed that story. All right. You know what, Pepper? Stop being a rebel and take the stairs. There we go. God damn. Okay. Oh god, I have to walk all the way up here. All right, we're doing this. At that point, you have to fake your own death, move to a different country and grow a mustache. <laughs> Absolutely right. I use entirely too much toilet paper when taking care of business. The thought of dirty ass is just mortifying. Yeah, I use a lot of wet wipes. Like, I don't care. Even if it comes out, like, dry, I'm still going. Not dry, but, like, clean. They'll be walking around with dookie between their cheeks. Ugh, nasty. Nasty. Could not be me. You got dingleberries up there? Nah. One word, bidet. I really want a bidet. Someone convinced J3 to buy me a bidet. I think he'd get me a bidet. He's the one that sent me that meme, so you know what? He owes me a bidet. It's official. That's how this works. Oh, y'all were waiting up here, huh? Y'all were waiting all the way up here while I had to walk my ass. Okay. Come back to y'all talking about dingleberries. Do you expect any less? With Dr. Bronner's? What's Dr. Bronner's? Wait, can I, can I start flying yet? Oh shit, wrong thing. Okay, why? Well, I'm a fucking idiot. We're not gonna talk about it. Alright, time to blow some horns, baby. Do -do -do! Do -do -do -do! Dr. Boners. Love that. Oh, she playing music. Oh. Uh... Sir? Oh my god, he's got like feathers! You know what? I don't blame Shiva. He's fine as fuck. I'd fold too. Like a fucking lawn chair. It does look like Falcor. I was thinking that too. By the twelve. My ears hear the tongue of dragons, yet the meaning rings clear within my mind. How can that be? 
Bracevelga. Do you not remember me? Twas I whom you found in Dravania. I who glimpsed the truth. He only has one eye. The truth about your past. About Shiva. Estinian, chill. Chill, babes. Chill. Chill. Relax. I know. That was intense. Relax. But speak it, I must. I have summoned Shiva's soul from the beyond and offered myself as her vessel. She has made her heart known to me. I have surrendered mine to her. Do you not see, my love? I am Shiva reborn! Was all this just to reunite long-lost lovers? God damn. Not gonna lie, a little jealous. As I can't tell if he's in denial or if he's right. <laughs> Jealous, you're absolutely right. She is down bad. Is the dragon language supposed to be really funny because that shit caught me off guard? No, it's not supposed to be funny. I like it. Do you guys want me to read what he's saying out loud, by the way? I can do that. Let me know because I know that maybe some people can't read the captions and you just kind of hear uh, Isail uh, <laughs> screaming. No, I speak dragon? Oh, I see. Okay, never mind. My bad. Read it in dragon. Ishvag vul vagolaki tu kulo baruga bafuahua shabo. And they say I'm not bilingual. Then the spirit that answered me. So we sail as crazy. Your whole life is a lie. Be that as it may, Lord Hracefelger, Isel's desire to heal the rift between man and dragon is real, and it has borne us this far. We would spare both our kind and yours the ravages of this senseless war. Pray join your voice to ours in a call for peace and forgiveness. Yeah! Can't go saying that about Estinian's mother. Listen, I said she was a beautiful woman, okay? I'm not talking shit. Okay? Say so I'm fine with that. Final Fantasy XIV has a lot of text and best to take the breaks when you can. This is true. I honestly don't like reading all the text out loud, to be honest. It dries out my throat. Um, But I do it for, like, the most part like for the main story stuff you know <laughs> bilingual talking about what you did with estinian last night to the dragon i did not do anything with estinian okay maybe i got him to dye his hair blue and just you know respond to horshafont that way i could protect look don't judge me okay it gets lonely up here all right i just want to go home to my man all right yeah, uh, I really like Alfie's new VO. Yeah. I want a 
figurine of him. I really like him. <laughs> Really cold in my office when I get If y'all don't mind, I'm gonna, um, make some, uh, mac and cheese really quickly. It'll only take, like, two seconds, because I have, like, the little heatable cup -y thingies. Give me one sec. I will go collect it in a second. Mac and cheese, mac and cheese. I am not putting pickles in my mac and cheese. Fuck y'all. This is so sad, I'm not gonna lie. Actually, really fucking sad. Excited to see what Estinian's reaction to this is going to be.
Dragon, don't hurt me. <laughs> Your oh. tale bears scant resemblance to the one I was taught. How convenient that it should absolve your kind of all responsibility. But tell me, dragon, why should I believe your version of events? Me having this stream on in the background while I work? Damn, that's fucking crazy. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, because you understand Dragonian, right? <laughs> it, okay, honestly, though, I've this is the only Final Fantasy game that I've ever played, and for what it's worth, uh, for what it's worth, um, the lore does go crazy. The lore is really, really, really good. And it is so enthralling because there's so much depth to this series. You know? And I think that's what I love about it. It's so fucking big. It is so big that I just get lost all the time. In, like, a good way, you know? My craft dinner is ready! It's beeping for me! It's beeping! I got my mac and cheese. I got my mac and cheese. And now my puppy's coming to me. My puppy smells the mac and cheese. <laughs> my puppy smells the mac and cheese. You smell the mac and cheese? My puppy smells the mac and cheese. My puppy wants the mac and cheese. My puppy can't get my mac and cheese because it's all for my stinky poopy. Look at him. He's got so much dirt on this side of his face. I have to wipe his face at some point today. Every time we go out and he shoves his face in the bushes, he gets so nasty. He's a pooper. He's a pooper stinker. Hey, Vincent! Thanks, buddy. Yeah, I definitely got the rest that I needed. I'm feeling a lot better. It, it was just like an hour or two of a break, you know? I just needed to kind of like... Take Waldo out, like rest a little bit, have some food. Am I so excited to, that she came back at an hour for us decrepits and just greeted by a fluffy chair? Well, hey, hey, now you have two fluffy chairs. Dude, these do hit different, they slap. What if Mackie Cheese was for puppy? No! No Mackie Cheese for baby. No Mackie Cheese for the baby. But instead, I got. Biscuit. I got a little biscuit for the baby. I got a little biscuit for the baby. He's a little tinky. He's my moogle. This is my little moogle. Are you my little moog? Come up. Up, 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 up. Yes, are you my little moogs? He's my little boongy shoogy. Look at him. Look at that face. That's a little moogle, if I've ever seen one. Oh, you dropped it. <laughs> Where'd it go? I heard it. Did you get it? Mr. Moo, where is it? Oh, I think he found it. Did you get it? Yeah, he got it. He's a monkey moo, he shoogie. He's a mamba samba shoo. He's a bubba. Oh, he's a boo. <laughs> How old is the cloud? He turned three in March. So he is just a big baby. Just a few noodles? I mean, yeah, like I've given Waldo like a noodle before, but this is my mac and cheese. It's my cheeb. My 
my tube. No tube for him. Inartorfonide. Arntorn for Didordi. Wait, what is this? One second. Alright. Okay. No. Alright, alright, we're good, we're good, we're good. Uh, that which thou imaginest a war of extension is but a punishment, a siege of the spirit. Hast thou not seen those who tire of the torment and those who abandon their own and set it with the dragon can? Ishgard's so called heretics. See, I say heretics, not heretics. Is it heretics? I say heretic. Heretics. Heretics, heretics. Yo, are we about to drink some dragon blood? Then the seed lies within us. Wait. Oh. <laughs> Ye gods, I have borne witness to such a transformation. Looked on as a heretic assumed the shape of a dragon. I imagined it some manner of Dravanian enchantment. But if any Ishgardian, regardless of allegiance, has such potential within them, twelve forgive us to think of all the dragons we've slain. War Ulmon Alaan as Drago Kawur Smain Korsu Thrahal Seskuni Se Ang in Kilisek. This is getting kind of spooky. Oft have I wondered why Nidhog did not simply raise Ishgard to the ground. Now I have my answer. He has no intention of winning the Dragon Song War, yeah. for it is no war at all, but vengeance. Yeah, but we knew that. An eternal requiem sung for his murdered sister. I have not come this far only to admit defeat. We can still return the eye to Nidhogg and beg forgiveness for our ancestors' crimes. Mayhap our words will sway him. I do love it when like ethereal and like immortal beastly entities <coughs> Oh shit <coughs> as well <coughs> a noodle. Um do the whole oh you mortals, you don't know shit. I love it. I love it when they call out the righteous. It's a really good trope. <coughs> Dead 
damn. So yeah, that's that's really interesting to think about too. Their concept of time versus our concept of time are two vastly different things. So even though his brood sister, you know, was murdered or slain, whatever word you want to use, long, 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 long ago for us, it was like yesterday for them. You know, like it is still fresh to them. Well, not yesterday, but damn. Putting things into perspective. <laughs> So, he's saying Shiva's soul is the only reason why he's still calm. Is Yusail going to give her her Izusi? To, uh, plea with him? I guess not. One sec. Let me eat my food. Horace Valgar was every bit as awe inspiring as I imagined. His voice fairly dripped with power. The will behind his words so undeniable that it transcended my ignorance of the dragon's tongue. It was but a pity that I misliked what he said. This becomes Shiva? I know. We explained that. They explained that. Sigh. So far did we travel, even unto the very heavens themselves, only to be dismissed like unruly children, and far from mitigating this humiliation, the hidden truths we have learned serve only to prove that our grand mission of peace was destined to fail from the first. Don't fucking tell me Ishgard is going to be up in flames when I come back. Nothing will deter Nedhog from his course. Is this better than the one that I have on for my for my my thingy? I'll just get the gold. The silver rather. Yeah, I get grumpy for ridiculous reasons to be honest, so. Alright, Alfino is considering your party's next course of action. Alright, let's see what happens here. It's a very pretty one, White Castle. Well, what do you actors. propose we do now? I, for one, am intent on continuing to the east. What is there to be found in the east? Nidhogg's lair, the Airy, is said to lie in that direction. And the eye tells me he is near. You cannot still mean to slay him. You cannot still mean to stop me. I have been true to my word and aided you in this fool's errand with Hraisvulga. But your efforts at Pali have come to naught, Lady Iceheart. I would see Ishgard saved, and for that, Nidhogg must die. I mean, he's not wrong. I'm not gonna lie, like, as compelling as the, as the story is and as, as sad as it is, He's going to murder so many innocent people over something that they had nothing to do with. With the tale of our ancestors' vile betrayal yet ringing in your ears. Yes! You speak of continuing this war? Because they are not their ancestors! Nay, lady. I would but pierce its vengeful heart. When Nidhogg dies... This war shall die with I'm scared. Him. I feel like Estinian is going to fucking die. There is so something juicy is going to happen. I don't know what it is. Obviously, we're going to win because we have to. Or maybe we don't win. I don't. I don't know. And everyone is okay with it. I love there is no right opinion here. Yeah, it's just whatever you, whatever, whoever side you're on. <laughs> God, I'm excited to see what Alfie has in store for us. Shiva and Nidhogg are gonna bang. 
I'm telling you, you gotta give up the the Yussi. <laughs> yeah, no, exactly, Jay, exactly. No, exactly. Oh, I was thinking like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Nope, I remember exactly what happened at the end of A Realm Reborn. Don't know about that one. This game has broken my heart before and I will not be surprised if it does it again. I do think Asinian also wants revenge, doesn't want to admit it in the end. I do think he is correct. Yeah, like there's definitely some more like, there's more underneath his brooding. But I mean, I, I'm also on his side. I do think he is right. You don't need to slaughter all the dragons, but like Nidhogg needs to be taken down or at least like reasoned with. Do you know what I mean? Like he needs to be stopped. A moment, Astinian. You yourself spoke of the Great Worm's strength, that you believed him powerful enough to raise your city to the ground. How then are we few to challenge him? Even behind the stout walls of Ishgard, with an army of knights manning the defenses, our victory would be hard won. Yet you propose to contend with the beast in his own lair. No, that's not a good idea. There was someone at work that looked just like you. I thought it was you. Then common sense kicked in. Good luck. Have fun. Thank you. In close combat, this will afford us an advantage. And if the tales are true, the Warrior of Light has bested many an invincible foe. All right, you want me to kill him? But such speculation is meaningless if we cannot even find the worm. Our first task must be to seek out Nidhogg's Hi, lair. Lucas. The story Damn. of this nation grows bloodier by the moment. Must death always be answered with more of the same? Such is the way of things, I fear. I shall consider it a miracle if mine armor is not stained crimson ere this conflict is ended. God, his armor I should is be sick. blinded by my own lies. Everything I believed, everything I thought I was, Gone. All gone. Pat, 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 pat. Leave her. Your words will not reach her now. And we have not the time to wait for her to gather up the pieces of her shattered faith. Ah, <sighs> yeah. Literally, your entire life is a lie, girl. How does that feel? Uh Are we going to slay dragons? I got no clue. I have no clue. Uh, yeah, I was voluntold, dude. All right, you still what's up? What false god is this Shiva? What manner of phantom have I welcomed into my heart? Oh. Sorry, girl. You know what? Can I fa no. I was gonna say, can I just like fast travel down? But, aha! I can just plummet. Oh, or not. Oh, yeah. All the people she killed? Yeah, everything. Everything for naught. Ay, yeah, 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 yeah. Poor thing. Well, it is what it is. Loving all the Final Fantasy content lately? Thank you. I'm glad. I'm loving it too. <laughs> Let me just like adjust my my camera a little bit just so, just so we can zoop it that way a little bit. Yeah. Oh, a little bit less. Yeah, I think that's good. That's good, I think. No. Let's go back to the way it was. <laughs> Alright, so we go this way. And then through here. What is oh fuck. What is flying if not falling with style? Amen! Amen. That's how I view it. Their fall damage in this game is actually pretty nasty. I got, it, like, it knocks me down to one sometimes, and if an enemy is beside me, it's game over. <laughs> I die. <laughs> Usually I'm pretty lucky, though. Fall damage? You mean shortcuts? Exactly. You mean quick teleportation devices? Defeat enemies as you search for the airy. Okay. Hello, dragons. I'm here to fight you.
Give me. Give me. Okay, bye bye. Let's see. Oh, did I not attune to that? Shiza, let me go back. I thought I did. I just swept up there. Pepper, please. I'm so sorry. Your um your cleaning duties are gonna be needed again. I'm gonna have to hire you again. Fox the Big Dragon talking about the travesties of the people. <laughs> Warrior of Light kills more dragons. Look, they were attacking me. It was self-defense. I had to do what I had to do. Okay. Streamer caught selling this in Final Fantasy player's mobile minion. I know. Oh my god. See me on the front page of Reddit. I'll be in the newspaper. I would- if I could, I would. I would steal their minion. Minion. Their- their, uh, their Moogle. In a heartbeat. In a heartbeat, I say. A heartbeat. Alright, monkey. Let's go. Can I fly it? No, I haven't found all of them yet. No. <laughs> there are a lot of areas that I still need to unlock here. And I really, really want to, but we're gonna just focus on the MSQ. Okay, okay, this, 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 oh god. Come on, King Kong, come on. Why do you so much Dimension 20 lately? Because Brennan is such a fantastic GM. Yeah, everyone loves him. I still haven't seen any of his, um, any of his one shots. I think he's doing a full campaign right now. I think tearing me away from it is a stream. Oh, stop it, Ember. That's very sweet of you. That's high praise. Your reactions to storage are so unique. Are they? Thank you. I'm glad you feel that way. My ego is being stroked, y'all. Ooh, what are you boogie boogie selling? Let's see. Repair gear. Oh, nothing. Oh, wait. What you selling? What can I buy from you? Oh, you're carrying these two. That means I can purchase the thingy here, right? Yeah. So I didn't end up getting this one, right? I got the other one. Yeah, I got this, right? Or did I end up getting this one? Did I not get either? Well, getting them now. All right. What in the Skull Island is this? You leave me and Winston alone. <laughs> the, warrior, the Warrior of Light has been kidnapped by a monkey? Ooh. Landlord colony? No. Abolish. Set it ablaze. Get rid. No landlords in my video game. No thank you. If you're the owner of a free company, are you technically a landlord? Huge. <laughs> Come on, monkey. As soon as Winston became mountable, Ayo in Overwatch too. Oh, he's been mountable. Winston's kind of hot. I can't lie. He's sweet. He's a good boy, and sometimes he's angry. What is your favorite Pokemon card in your collection? I have a few. I think my favorite might be my Ampharos. I don't remember what one it is though. Let me see. Ampharos base set? No, it's not base set. Is it jungle or whatever? Hold on, let me look it up. Ampharos, Ampharos Jungle. Oh fuck, I don't remember what set it's from. This one, it's this one, it's this one. Neo Genesis, Ampharos, a uh, first edition Neo Genesis. Yes, from Neo. Yep, yeah. I have two of them. I have two of them. I love it so much. It's this card. Hold on. 
Let me see if I can find like a nice link to the card. Yeah, this one will have to do. It's an Amazon link, but this one. Love this card. I have two of them. They're my babies. Are my caps on? Yeah, they are. Okay, cool. Oh, what the fuck? Get out of here. Winston's got PTSD from fighting uh, Godzilla. Stop it. No more dinos. This is a pre record stream? It's not. I know. I don't know why my bot um, isn't detecting my streams anymore. It's really frustrating, but it's okay. I'll fix it eventually. Ew, is that dragon blood or like goop? What is that goop? Do you see that on the trees? Can you see that? Aww. I am a fool. Ah, fantasy goop, I see. My favorite. Another one. Suck my dick. Suck my pee pee. Where is the relationship advice? What relationship advice do you want me to give you? I have one regular hollow, no first edition though. Found my childhood album and had like 15 hollows. One was Ampy. Hell yeah. Ampy is one of the one of my favorite Pokemon. Ampharos, Sableye. Uh, Haxorus, Dragonite, love them. Arcanine, Arcanine is so good. All the babies. How many more Aether Currents do you need? I don't know. Is it... <laughs> is it the Churning Mist that I'm in right now? Yeah. Oh! <gasps> Wait! Oh. No, I thought I had them all. I guess not. Ah, there's a quest there. And I can't pick it up. Is there anything I can get rid of? Which one of these should I get rid of? I'm gonna get rid of this one. Mr. Sliphold and Mrs. Uptight? Yo, it's me. Vosk, are you cleaning again? Hey, what's over here? Slay telly hands? Fuck it, let's go slay some telly hands, baby. Let's finish up this quest. It'll be easy. Oi! Ayo! Oh, I thought that was gonna do more damage. That quest log? I know. I cleared up a lot of it earlier, but I gotta do it again. <laughs> Hi, Kelsey! What's up? Oh, Sandslash is a really good Pokemon. Really underrated, for sure. Hello? Game? Eating some pasta. Is everyone having pasta today? Seems like it. I had my mac and cheese. Everyone else is having like noodles of some sort. Chicky parm, I think my friend had earlier. This is a pasta day, huh? That's under the quest. Yeah. Good job, me. Good job. Very cool. Very good. Thank you. Thank you. This is exactly what I wanted. Mm 
I'm not sorry earlier my relationship advice is to shower often. Yes. Shower often and know your worth. I, I can't really give relationship advice. I'm in no position to do so. If you want pasta, I'll be making that tonight. Hell yeah. What kind of pasta are you going to make tonight? What pasta exactly do you want? Wait. Can I fly here now? No. No, not yet. Alright. Hello, Estinian. Thank you for the hydration. Thank you. Have a good night. Is that it? Oh, that's crazy. I'm seeing thunder in real life and in here. Aye. That would be the airy. I feel Nidhogg's presence through the eye. His caustic hatred gnawing at my soul. Twould seem the death of his consort has put him on guard. Mark how he wards his lair with tempestuous winds. A similar barrier once barred our entrance to the primal Garuda's domain, until we discovered the means by which it could be penetrated. Was that a smile? Mayhap it is time we called upon Master Garland. It will be just like the good old days, no? Wait, Sid? Do you mean Sid? My boy Sid? Silver pieces. Nacho, nacho man. Da, 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 da. Oh, I'm level 60! Suck my fucking pussy, baby! Let's go. Um, do I do my do I do my summoner quest or what? Hmm. A force of sufficient power to break through a primal's defenses might conceivably grant us access to the airy. And I can offer no better solution. Pray consult this engineer friend of yours. Very well, on the condition that you swear not to lure Nidhogg from his lair in our absence. And steal all the glory for myself, you mean? Nay, I am not so selfish as that. Contact me by Link Portal when your preparations are complete, and we shall set forth from Ishgard together. Alright. I suggest we rendezvous back at St. Rain, Ren, Rain, Ren, Renette's, Saint Renette's Forum, Pepper. From what I gleaned of the Holy See's decidedly ambitious airship project, Sid will still be in Ishgard. Okay, I guess I have some time to do it then. A flair for the dramatic. Bug it, we go. Bug it. <laughs> oh, that person's name was Einstein? Estinian. Very close, though. Very close. Oh, look, you can see my little Ampharos behind me right there. I got two. There's one there and then one there. <laughs> All right. Can you buy your dinner first? Well, I mean, you can. Oh, yeah, I also have a Relic Reborn to do. But I don't know where to get this. I don't know where to get the uh, the thingy of Vayu or whatever. So that kind of blows. Why did I even open that? I'm just gonna try selling something. We gotta do it over here. It doesn't matter which one I open because we're going over here. And I have these to sell. And I think I might have some stuff in here to sell too. Maybe not actually. No, I may have lied. I swear I got some new armor that was kind of just dog, right? Oh yes, I don't need this, I believe. I'm pretty sure the wool farm stuff that I got I'm in, are of no use to me. I think I must have sold the other ones already. Yeah, I did already. 
These aren't good either, but I know one of my classes are currently using them. Alrighty, what's this? Wait? What am I waiting for? Dang, you're rich? I do be. The relic quest is very, very long? Yeah. You just sold the Wolfram outfit? Yeah, but it was ugly. Why would I want to keep it? I'm not you, Jay. <laughs> I don't need lore items. Or, can or canon items. It's hideous. I'm never going to use it. The vibes? No, babes. No, it's ugly. <laughs> Look at her. Look at my baby right now. She looks baller as fuck. Her white outfit? The pearly whites? Nah, come on. Ah, wonderful. We're all here. I've been pondering some metaphysical theories and will discuss my conclusions with both of you. Right? Ever since our battle in the flats, the memory of our adversary fleeing the field has been preying upon my mind. According to the science and their research, the paragons are effectively immortal. They are said to be ethereal entities with no physical form of their own, instead of possessing mortal host after mortal host in an endless pr procession down the ages. But once Pepper had acquired the Dreadworm Trance, the haste with which the Asian withdrew did not seem to me the action of a being who harbors no fear of death. Thus do I pose the question, could it be that the Twelfth Chalice and his Black Mask Brethren are not as practiced in the art of possession as the Red Veiled Masters? At the time of the battle, our bodies were the only available hosts nearby. Assuming that he also lacks his superior's facility to flee to the space betwixt worlds, I suspect that our foe's sudden cowardice stemmed from an inability to force his soul into our living vessels. That would explain much, including the reason why he chose a deceased Cahaden Kah to serve as his puppet. Am, am I the weird one? Yes. Oh, it's craftable? Look at that, Jay. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, I know that the relic quest or whatever, the relic quest line, if I do something specific, I get a cool name that I want or like a cool title that I want, but I don't remember what it is. Armor YSL. Exactly, baby. No, my whole fit will be Saint Laurent. I'm telling you. Not so fast, Captain Wolf. We must first attain the means by which we can ensure the Asian's uh, demise. A mighty coup de grace, or coup de grace, I guess, delivered before he has a chance to retreat. Pepper, there is a passage within the last tombstone that describes how the power of a trance can be unleashed. <laughs> Asians, 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 yada 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 yada. Okay. I'll read about it later. Where is it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's in an area that I've never fucking been. I can't even get there, I think. Until I learn how to fly. Oh, no, 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 I can. Wait, can I get here from... Oh, 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 oh. From where? From where in Kurthus? Aha. Aha. I see. Wait. But I can't fly here either. David, thank you for the 22-month resub. I appreciate it. I'm a bit jealous that you get to hang out with Yumitra. You should be jealous. You should be. I am jealous that um, um, other people get to hang out with you. Got him. I'm sure someone can ferry you. Yeah, uh, let me call my Uber. Sarnix! Vincent! <laughs> Where are my Uber drivers? My Uber Javier! Where's my Uber Javier? <gasps> Jay, are you gonna come be my Uber? Are you gonna come be my Uber? I'm waiting! Mm 
waiting for my Uber driver, you know, it's a little, I know it's like rush hour, but it's getting a little bit ridiculous. Does she mention uh, Ishtola? I don't think she ever does. I think some of the beginner summoner quest lines she does. I think like something up vaguely mentions her sister, but I think that's it. What about the guy who took you to the middle of nowhere? Sarnix? I don't know where he is. You have no dual mounts? God damn it. What are you good for, Jay? What are you good for? Do I have any dual mounts? I do not. I mean, I could get some. I could go buy one. <laughs> but that's redundant because you wouldn't... I can't. Eh. Well, I guess we're not doing this one yet. Oh? Vincent, my boy! I can't, e I can't get on your chocobo, Vincent. <laughs> Come on, Vincent. Come on, boy. Come on. Give me a rad, baby. Sarnix doesn't know where Sarnix is either. You're right. You can? It's not It's not saying I can. Oh, wait. You do have a big seat. Oh, ride pillion. I missed it. My bad. Giddy up! Go forth, my liege! Uba Javier! We are going to, um, to, uh, to, uh, oh, technically? I mean, I, you, t technically, you could have, I mean, we could have met in Kurt. I, you could have taken me to Kurt. I, uh, you know, this works. This works. It's a sad day when Sarah decided to get on Chocobo. It's okay. Go, go. Andale, Andale. It's for the roleplay, Vincent. It's for the roleplay. Go with it. Go with it. Andale, Andale. Pepper is on a Chocobo in the sky for the first time. She is terrified. Oh, my God. Everyone looks so small from below. I usually just sit in the arms of a hunking ape. He just holds me by my boobs and I fly. But now I'm on the back of a chicken. Oh, the horror. I don't think you can go to where you're trying to get. No, you're fucking kidding me. Do I actually have to go further into the MSQ? No, you're kidding me. Am I doing all this for naught? Am I doing all this for naught? It says, like, I just, there's like a connecting area here and a connecting area here. So technically I should be able to go, right? No, is it story locked? Vincent, is it story locked? Are we going on this chicken adventure for nothing? <laughs> Wait, where do you need to go? <laughs> I need to go. I need to speak with Yumitra at the Great Google Library. We gotta go to the Google Library. <laughs> Great googly moogly, we gotta go to the Google Library. You're like one area behind. So you're telling me, you're telling me you're you're telling me that I can't access this area from here nor here. There is no way for me to get here at all unless I do the MSQ. Why are you clapping? Why are you clapping at me? Don't rub it in. Don't rub it in. <laughs> no. Well, well, back to the story I go. All right, where am I going? We're in an Ishgard, right? This damn game. This damn game. <sighs> Look, I'm doing my best, okay? All right, I had hope. I had dreams, I had like aspirations, and they got shot down. What is this? One second chat. Does it have to go all the way? Could you imagine? Could you, could you imagine if Vincent took me all the way? I went all the way with Vincent for naught. Many adventures ahead. Many adventures ahead, my friend. <laughs> Alright, okay. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? 
When you last saw Master Garland, he was advising the Ishgardians on their ailing airship, correct? In that case, he might still be at Camp Cloudtop. Failing that, we could try the airship landing, or mayhap even the Sky Soul Manufactory. But let's not waste time searching aimlessly, as someone in the city is sure to know where to find him. The question is who? So Emmerich would know, or is it Emmerich? Or is it Emmerich? It's Emmerich, right? So Emmerich wouldn't seem the obvious choice, but there's no guaranteeing he'll be able to grant us an audience at such short notice. Ah, I have it. Count Edmond's youngest son prides himself on knowing all of the Holy See's juiciest rumors. Let us return to the manor and see if Lord em Emanolaine, Emanolaine is about. Well, you know what? I hope I get a nice surprise from my boy. I hope my boy is in there. I want to see my boy. I know he's probably at Camp Dragonhead, being cold, drinking his hot cocoa. Let me in! Was that based on the accents here? Good, sexy. I don't see my boy. I don't see my boy. Okay, I want, I want their outfit. I want that coat so fucking bad. How do I get it? How do I get it? And remember that hood that I got? How do I get that but dieable? <laughs> ah, the hero returns. How goes the fight, old girl? Well, I trust. Hmm? In search of a Sid Garland, you say? Then say no more. The taverns are full of talk in the name of said silver-haired genius has cropped up more often than most. I hear he has been tasked with getting that monstrous airship the Holy Sea Commission to actually fly. It would seem the project has been played with mishaps from the first. Where's my royalties, T? You just have a key to that place? I know. Guys, come on. I could just be roomies. You get that coat in the story? Okay. It's gutchy. Wow. It is gutchy, isn't it? Very nice. Kill Vincent's chocobo? Oh, is that how I receive um, the diable uh, hood? Very nice. <laughs> In, in any case, Garland Ironworks employees are known to frequent the airship landing, and I'll wager their master does too. The airship landing? Yes, I thought as much. Come, Pepper. We must find Sid and trouble him for his expert opinion. Wait, if I'm here... Hold on. Oh? I got new goods? But first, if I'm in Ishgard, then... Then, then that must mean that I'm just gonna switch real quick. Then, then I gotta, I gotta, I gotta wear my little, my little, my little outfit. Wait, is my hat not gonna? Yeah! <laughs> Here I go. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> I got my little coat <laughs> I would imagine your name is pronounced like Peppa by the cast. Peppa. Peppa. Pe fuck. My name is probably Peppa Pig. God fucking shit. It's so gutchy. Yeah, baby. I love the brand Gutchy and Yissel. I'll see myself out. Yeah, you've ruined me. Where's Sid, babes? Where's Sid? Ah! Sid. Oh, Sid's looking mighty comfy and cozy. God damn. God damn. Hello. Can you look down at me, please? Oh, God, your breath. All right. We're going to go back to uh, <laughs> to Summoner. Okay. Really? Really, game? You're making me focus on Alderaan? Pepper, Alfino, how fare you both? Not terribly well, judging by your faces. Greetings, Master Garland. I'm sure it will come as little surprise when I tell you we have need of a favor. <laughs> Another wind barrier? You say it was conjured by Nidhogg? Hmm. The Enterprise could certainly take you where you need to go. 
but she would not fare well against dragons. She's agile for a ship her size, but not that agile. The Dravanians would fly rings around her. No, I didn't know what YSL was, I have to look it up. That's okay. Not a lot of people know um, some of those uh, designer brands. That's all right. And if they took it into their heads to incinerate the rigging, there would be a precious little we could do to avoid them. But there must be something we can do, some manner of weapon we can employ. Asinian stands vigil at the edge of the churning mist, but we do not know for how much longer. All right, all right. I didn't say it wasn't possible. I said it was impossible for the Enterprise. We need a smaller boat. Biggs, Wedge, it's time we gave that new toy of, our, uh, la, 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 of yours a proper field test. It's probably best if I let the lads show you. Come on, the manufactory is not far. What if I said I only called it Yissel in a convo, then stealthily stepped it back? You're the worst. You are the worst. That's what you are. Nothing more, nothing less. I want my fudgy old cookies. I want cookies. I'm so hungry. I don't know why. I'm so sorry, Chad. I gotta go get some cookies. What if I- wait. I laugh every time I notice Sid has a small goggle for his third eye. Wait, what? He does? That's kind of funny. Jay, if you are in here, I'm very sorry, but I have some sad news. I ate all the wafers. I promise you this though, Jay. Next time you come here uh, for the holidays, does Toronto have a fashion week? They, we do have a fashion week. Um, next time you come here for the holidays, I will stock up on some for you. I think you like the Oreo ones, right? Not the Oreo ones, but the cookies and cream. I got you, babes, I got you. Uh, but yeah, fashion week I do believe is in autumn. All right, so I'll take this etherite. You're the only treat I need? Stop. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> you can't, you can't, you can't say these things to me <laughs> on stream. <laughs> Stop it. Stop. Stop. <laughs> Bad. Because <laughs> you're so sweet, I am. Thank you. Yeah, go get your cookies, Ember. Get your cookies and get cozy with us. Other pod is just inside. Oh, you're gonna like this one. Am I? We have found Cyrus only weakness. Compliments? No, 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 no. I love compliments. I beg for compliments. But sometimes Jay gives Fish me- your eyes upon our latest and greatest feat of engineering. We call it a mana cutter. After you put down Gaius, Wedge and me struck out on our own for a bit and started work on the successor to the tiny Bronco. Stop. Impressive little thing, isn't she? My talent for ship design has plainly rubbed off on them. Ha <laughs> ha. 
That's so cute. They've adapted the principles of corrupted crystal technology and constructed a mechanism which converts ether from its surroundings into elemental wind. Said wind is then harnessed by the specially engineered sails, providing the craft with propulsion and lift. All in all, a most elegant solution. I'm actually a little upset that I didn't think of it myself. The design does, however, come with one small flaw. The energy conversion ratio is bloody awful. To generate enough power to get you off the ground, you need to be in an area awash with predominantly wind-aspected ether. So I'm assuming we're going to the right place? In other words, there are a few places you can fly, lots of places you can't. The new Ishgardian airship hasn't left the boys much time for tinkering, meaning it may be a while before this particular project takes off. If you'll forgive the pun. I will. I will forgive the pun. <sighs> Tataru, what's happened? I've been looking all over for you. There's been word from Alda. It's about her grace, the Sultana. Oh? Is she up? It seems you're required elsewhere. Leave the mana cutter with us. We'll see that she's airworthy and suitably equipped to slice through those winds. I liked how he said that. That got me excited. You, meanwhile, should concentrate on providing Raoban and the Sultana whatever help they need. I shall do that. Second chat. Okay. Hi, Kushia. What's up? Am I pronouncing that correctly? Kushia? Kashia? Kushia? What's up? No, have two seconds? Well, thank you. Thank you for the two secs. It's a lot of sex. Tataru has news for you from Ulda. General Roban says they have uncovered the Sultana's whereabouts, and he wants you, by which I mean both of you, to go to the Waking Sands right away and help with the investigation. Come, Pepper. Pressing through Ishgard's plight may be... A pressing... Pressing though Ishgard's plight may be, our presence here will not serve to hasten the mana cutter's completion. Let us return to the troubled lands of Thanalan and lend what aid we may. Tataru, have our friends at the congregation send a message to Estinian. Tell them we have identified a solution to our problem, but that it will take some time to prepare. As you wish, Master Alfino. You said it right? Okay, good. I almost forgot that Tataru has a voice. I know. Thank you for the hydration. Mmm. All righty, babes. All righty. Thanalan it is. Where are we going? Waking Sands. Oh, do I have a... Uh, I don't think I have any more envelopes yet for the Waking Sand. I do not. Is there any way that I can just, like, get those? Probably not, right? Wash down the cookies? I did. They have been washed. I thought you were going into the Jurassic Park theme. Me, Vincent? Is Vincent still here with me? I see you on the radar. That's the next expansion. Final Fantasy Dinosaurs. Oh, hell yeah. Give me that dinosaur DLC. I mean, there were dinosaurs in that dragon area. There was literally a dinosaur, and I was like, 
hey, that looks like a Tyrannosaurus Rex. And then I clicked on it and it said Tyrannosaur. So I was like, yeah, yeah. God, I gotta fix my hairline. I gotta get the pepper hairline going. The pepper hair. Mrs. Pepper. Peppermint. Is that my little peppermint? Is that my dearest peppermint? Dude, hell yeah, my monkey can fucking fly, baby. Dude, monkey go. Monkey noom. I'm assuming they wanted me to go down here, right? Yeah, yeah, the waking sands. Using his farts to fly. <laughs> My boy, Daddy. Thank you for coming. No thanks are necessary, General. I trust your recuperation continues apace. I cannot complain. Thanks to Higiri and her ministrations, I've regained much of the strength I lost during my imprisonment. He sounds a little bit like Sean Bean. What do you think? I gather you have made progress in the search for her grace. Aye, some good fortune at last. A few days past, Dulala informed us that a sizable shipment of alchemical supplies had been delivered to the palace. With Papa Shan's assistance, I set out to ascertain the source and nature of the shipment. My inquiries led me to Frondale's frontistry. There, I learned that an order had been placed for a curious substance designed to sustain patients trapped in death-like slumber. Brock, hello! An invention Thank you for of the, the former raid. head alchemist, apparently. How was your stream? What did you get up to? What was going on? Hi, everybody. My name is Tyra. I am a variety streamer. Thank you, Juan, for the five-month reset. I'm Friday streamer. We're currently playing Final Fantasy Online. I am slowly but surely burning through the Heaven's Ward DLC. We're doing the main story, and it is quite the time. Can you do his voice, Mr. Rain? Ha! 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 Teddy! I don't... Ted, teddy! I... Yes, this is my teddy. Hmm. Yes. Quite. Ha! <laughs> See, he talks something like that, right? I can't, like, get it properly without going, like, all goofy with it. A death-like slumber. This cannot be a coincidence. It's not, babes. It's it really not a coincidence. It some to Dulala's claims, aye. Her grace is likely somewhere within the palace, a bed but alive. Before making any attempt to extricate the Sultana, however, it seemed prudent to learn what manner of substance was used to induce her torpor. To that end, I made inquiries as to the whereabouts of the one most like to have administered it. The lady in waiting. Meriel, we sent for you as soon as we learned of her location. All that remains is to apprehend the woman. Get her! We shall find our cat's paw in the silver bazaar. Cat's paw? Our cat's paw? But we must tread carefully. The market is not the bustling place it once was, and someone is sure to mark our coming. Should they inform the monetarists, we'll have a fight on our hands. We must be prepared for the worst, and being short an arm, I thought it wise to take another in its stead. What say you, warrior of light? Will you lend me yours? Yes, absolutely. Then I pity the bastard that stands in our way. Come, my friend, for Nanamo and for Ulda! Yeah! This is his moment. This is our moment. <laughs> fucking love Robon? Me fucking too. Me too. Yugiri is beautiful. I'm not the biggest fan of auras, to be honest. I think their concept is cool, but there's something about, like... I don't know. I just- I wish they were more, like, sharp. I don't know how to describe it. Right. Question Silver Bazaar residence. Oh, yeah, she wanted me to do something. Maybe I should have been paying attention. <laughs> I did not read that, though. Where, what's her cry count? I haven't cried at all yet. 
I cried at the end of uh, the post A Realm Reborn content, but I have yet to cry because of Heaven's Ward, question mark. I can only assume that I will, but... Sora, uh, Syra likes auras? Syra's like auras? Wait, what? I like auras. I said I'm not the biggest fan of them. I mean, has a nice voice and I believe he does voice acts in games like Oblivion. I'm Yeah, I'm pretty sure he does do uh, uh, video game VOAs. I don't know. I don't know what ones, but... Yours will be coming? Oh, good. Oh, good. Aura all look either dopey or extremely angsty. I, I know. Like, um, Sig Sig Sigur Sigurney, Sigurney Weaver, whoever that guy was in the Dark Knight quest. Like him. Super fucking edgy. Thank you, monkey. Alright, spotted meadow. Hey! That person is doing the same quest as me! They made it here! Hi, friend! I don't know who you are, but I wave anyways. I do a- I do a wave. Hello! <laughs> do you collect Funko Pops? I do not. I do not collect Funko Pops. I don't like them. I have some from a long time ago, but I'm not the biggest fan of them. If you'd like- if I just like saying Sigourney Weaver's name around times a lot of stress. Ah, Sigourney Weaver. Sigourney Weaver. Oh, she looks like a little like a little goth girlfriend. Love her. I'm I am gonna steal their Moogle. I am. That's my Moogle now, thank you very much. Definitely fits his role for sure. I wonder what's gonna happen to that girl he was with. Mariel? Aye, she's here. Left the city for good, she says. Barely leaves her house, though. Hmm? It's the one close to the market entrance? Alright, search for Mariel. Okay, so we're looking for this person named Mariel, apparently. And I don't know why Yugiri said something, so I'm actually gonna go speak to her really quickly. And see if she can just give me a TLDR or something. I see that Caribbean tag. What's your ethnicity? I am Persian and Indo-Guyanese. Our target is Muriel, the Sultana's former lady-in-waiting, a woman of Midland or heritage. I am told the two of you have met. Our sources indicate that she left the palace shortly after the incident and quietly rejoined the dwindling population of the Silver Bazaar. I suggest we been, begin by I suggest we begin by questioning the Marcus residents and then confirm that Muriel is still in hiding here. All right, perfect. Hmm. Are you in here? No, probably not. Oh, she is in here. That was a. Uh, that was easy. <laughs> you are Meriel, the Sultana's former lady in waiting. I know no one of that name. Pray excuse me. Oh, ho, ho. General Alden. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Start talking. We will have the truth from you, girl. Not to Leggy. Mayhap. Or Lolorito, be that's it. Coming from me. Ah. Uh, nor that little cunt. Lolorito. I get all those little fellows mixed fast. up. They all got weird ass fucking names. As you know, Teleji Adeleji's Cartano reclamation bill was no more than a facade. 
a means to get his grubby little hands on that Alagan monstrosity Omega. When he learned of Nanamo's intention to abdicate, however, he was forced to amend his plans. Suddenly, assassination seemed the most promising way to further his ambitions. I now know who he reminds me of. Neil Patrick Harris. I will say no more. I am told Teleji had discovered a maid in whose veins ran the blood of House Thorn. A new, more pliable puppet to sit the throne. Twould have caused an uproar, of course, but few could have contested her claim. I'm not wrong, and you guys know it. Twas plain that Teleji's wild machinations had outgrown our ability to control them. So I decided to usurp his scheme and left the fool to seal his own demise. And what of Nanamo? Oh, I have no desire to harm her grace. Twould profit me little to destabilize our government. Thus did I employ young Mariel here to administer a potent sleeping potion in place of a poison. You should know, General, that your dear friend Ilbert was fully aware of my plan. I had him lie about the assassination as a means to prime your rage against Teleji. We weren't entirely sure how you would react, but things went rather better than expected. You conniving little worm! Ooh, this angle. You had your claws in the Crystal Braves before their first recruit had sworn to serve! But of course, when a new game begins, tis only prudent to have a piece on the board. Ilbert was mine. Truth be told, a significant proportion of the Braves' initial endowment was also mine. With such large sums moving about, twas a rather trifling matter to disguise my own contribution. Ah, Ilbert. Hmm. I secured his services with a promise to support his cause once my authority had been solidified. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I swear, mm -mm. the man thinks of naught but prizing Alamigo from the grasp of the Empire. Unlike you, General, the poor fellow seems quite unable to forsake the land of his forefathers. Mayhap, that's why he called you a traitor to your people and a disgrace to your homeland, amongst other things. What was it he always compared you to? Uh, oh, yes, an overgrown lapdog begging for scraps at the Sultana's table. <laughs> oh, how we laughed. I really hope he squeezes this guy like a troll dog, a troll dog, a troll doll, and his eyes pop out. Alas, ill birds entertaining little outbursts eventually gave way to wearisome tirades, and the zealous brute became rather unruly. I had no wish to see you executed, you understand, but he would not take no for an answer. Rest assured, his employment with me has long since ended. Which brings us neatly to the present. What say what you, General? Both you and the Sultana are alive. We have one corpse and one fugitive. And preparations have been made to restore your good name. Shall we cry quits and start again with a blank ledger? Hmm? Good and hey, Jay, yes, this is stream number two. I am balls deep into Heaven's Ward, and I will not let myself um, stray from this fucking game. The hells we will! Do you honestly expect me to forgive and forget? After all you've done, you're guilty of high treason! Stay your blade, Master Alden! You yourself are not innocent. Or have you forgotten your own crime in executing Teleji ah, yes, that's what happened. without trial? It's coming back to me. Though you I remember that, I remember that. Sultana, 
Such deeds are in violation of both the word and spirit of the law. Fuck him up, dude! Fuck it! Fuck it! If you would, Lord Lollarito. Is this why people hate Lollafells? Because I get it. <laughs> this potion will wake the Sultana from her slumber. Consider it a gesture of conciliation. Mm, why, mm, you will find her grace resting comfortably within no, her private no, chambers. No, 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 Should you no, doubt no, no, my no, no, word, no, 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 I shall no, no, willingly no, no. accompany you to the no, palace as your no, no, hostage. No, 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 no. Take a sip first. Like not your motives, Lollarito, but you saved the Sultana's life, and for that, you have my gratitude. I don't know. Listen, I was once a falafel, okay? And then I changed into being a cat girl, alright, 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 alright. Rauban Aldin. You are hereby reinstated as General of the Immortal Flames. The citizens of Uldar shall once more be united under Nanamo Ulnamo. And together we shall usher in a new age of prosperity. And I'm a bunny boy? Hell yeah. I like the bunny boys. Yeah, Mango, these angles are quite nice. I am looking respectfully. He is fine as fuck. Walk of shame. Damn. I don't know how to even digest any of that, to be honest. If anything happens to Roban, I will be fucking angry. I'll be angry. I love that, man. Alright, Alfie, what's up? By the 12, I fear Lord... I feared Lord Lolorito's arrival would herald another bloodbath. Little did I suspect that he, of all people, would gift us the means to rouse the Sultana. Shall we also make our way to Ulda? I should imagine Bartholomew has been instructed to admit us. Oh yeah, in the, uh, in the casino thing. In the royal hall or whatever they call it, right? Yeah. Oh, my wrist. My wrist is pounding. I feel like, do you think my chiropractor can fuck with my wrist a bit? Oh, do I have chiro tomorrow? Do I have chiro tomorrow or Friday? Oh no, I do have it tomorrow. Thank God. Alright. Let's see, where is it? The Husting Strip. I love the old Doth theme so much. Actually, I don't know if it's the old off theme, but just that theme is so good. Oh my god, it's you again! We're literally doing the same quest. This is hilarious. So I got the window, the lightning is going crazy. I know, I can see it. Twilight and Thanalan, is that what it's called? It's really nice. I'm gonna watch Filming Pasta. What type do you suggest? Mac and cheese! I suggest mac and cheese. Look, this person's doing it too. Yo, their armor though? Holy shit, what in the world of Warcraft? I have those same horns. I 
Oh, they're wearing uh, a glam. I think. That's PvP armor? It's fucking sick. Are Kairos worth it? Mine is. It's not worth it for a lot of people, but for me it is. My- I had, um, I have arthritis, so he's been helping my back a ton. It's really expensive though, so honestly, just start doing yoga, start doing like way more- like just yoga and stretches and stuff, and you know. Do those kinds of things. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. He saw her. She sleep. She breathed. Oh, the Mughal plushie. Look at her little toes. How is her hair still in pigtails? Oh, this better work. the longest dream oh she looks so tired it is time to wake up your grace another day begins in Thanalan and the sun blazes bright upon the sands I'm not crying. I'm not crying. Her grace is awoken. The palace physician assures me she is none the worse for her slumber. I'm not crying. Okay, I'm not crying. I believe her grace will soon resume her plans to place the government just, of Uldar uh, into the hands of its bit. citizens. Whatever path she chooses to take, I shall walk it with her. And we shall tread slowly, lest the nation be unsettled in our wake. Yeah, it's just a little leak. Just a little leak, that's all. Her grace's compassion is a shining beacon to us all. But what our city truly thrives upon is competition. Tis in the struggle against our rivals that opportunities are seized and fortunes made. And with the Empire on the offensive once more, now would hardly seem the time to turn our system of government upon its head. Are you privy to new intelligence, my lord? What's going on here? I would hardly call it new. Remind me, what was the name of that enormous Imperial warship which met its end in Mordona? Oh, wait, I have it. The Agrius. Yes, well, it would appear that the Galeans have been hard at work on another such vessel. How close are they to completing this ship? Is it operational? Dude, I gotta deal with dragons. I can't deal with this with shit now. I, hear. I should imagine Emperor Varys is eager to see how it performs in battle. My lords and ladies, I move that it is time to repair the damage caused by Telegi Adelegi and prepare our great nation to repel the Empire once more. Anyone else think that these chairs are too big? 
Or is it just me? Tis well that the Sultana has awoken. The Syndicate yet needs to put its house in order, but twould seem the worst of the confusion has passed. Uldar has taken control of its future, and I must do the same. What does that mean? <laughs> I have decided to disband the Crystal Braves. Among the recruits, there were those who supported our order's goals and convictions with all sincerity. Tis my hope that these loyal men and women will choose to remain our allies in the battles to come. You know what? I stand by that decision. Y'all did nothing but big trouble. <laughs> As for those who sided with the traitor, Ilbird, they shall be hunted down and held to account for their crimes. It is my earnest hope that they will surrender themselves peaceably when the time comes. Though I think it unlikely. Ah, oh, my all conquering tough, crystal yeah. braves. The model oh, army man. meant to pave the way for a single unified grand company of Eorzea. That so high an ideal should be brought so low. I, I feel so bad for how deeply the betrayal stung me. Yet I see now everything that, it was that he my own worked towards naivety and crumbled. pride which allowed the braves to fall prey to corruption. Just like um he sail, I guess. As ever, it is to your own shining example that I turn for inspiration. Like you, I mean to stand firm in the face of hardship and give mine all for the cause. Let us resume the search for our missing comrades. That we might come together to shine the light of dawn across the realm once more. Missing comrades, isn't it comrades? The role of Crystal Brave Commander suited me ill, and I shall play it no longer. I agree. Henceforth, no, for, no offense. I shall be no more or less than Alfino, proud member of the Scions. King shit. I guess Prince shit. <laughs> New chairs that come to every possible race that are huge. It's hilarious to me. Like, I know that's 100% the case, but it's so fucking funny. I'm blessed to speak thus of mine inner turmoil. But the fact remains, there's no woman alive in whom I'd rather confide. Were it not for your shining example, I might never have emerged from beneath the pal, the pal, the pal, the pal of my desire. <laughs> Alfino would know how things stand at the rising stones. So what is that? Rising, rising stones? Still no word from Master Garland. I hope this mana cutter of theirs is nearing completion. I fucking hope so too. I would like to get back to that aspect of the main mission. I am assured that her grace will make a full recovery. I and Elda too shall flourish once more. Whoa, that lightning was insane. General Bon and his colleagues have matters well in hand, I believe. Lady Ugiri, I have a question if I may. I believe your people have been keeping a close watch on the Crystal Braves. May you know how things stand at the Rising Stones? One sec, chat. There it is. Ah, yes, of course. A oh, fuck! You will be pleased to something, something, something to me? I see. I'm grateful to hear that at least, that at least some of our members were true to their oaths. Ere we, ere we return to Ishgard, I must go to the Rising Sun and thank stalwarts for their service. And shall be my final act as Crystal Brave Commander. Will you join me, Pepper? You were there at the Companion's inception. Does only thing that you be present at its end. Sure. Mm. And I'd appreciate the support. Aw, Alfie, I got you. No, Waldo isn't really scared of lightning. At least not anymore. He used to be really scared of thunder. That used to get him real bad. He doesn't like loud noises. He's scared of trucks. If you go for a walk and like a garbage truck um like goes past us, oh my god. So it's barking up a storm, he charges at it and everything. Okay. A cat girl go pew pew attains level 21. Very nice. Man, I wish I could like lay back. I really want to lay down and play. I want to get like super duper comfy. Why are we going in? 
here. Fuck shit balls. Can't imagine Walla charging at a truck. Have you never seen it happen? He lunges and pulls and rah, 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 rah. You've never seen it? Oh, it's so funny. Commander, you're alive. That NPC is very cute with the short hair. You gotta get as comfy as possible with the cutscenes, literally. And like, Herman Miller's are great chairs, but I cannot lean back in them. Like, I can't, like, eh, you know? And Pepper, too. I knew you'd scrape through. My splendid Crystal Braves, I have wronged you, all of you. My promises of glory and salvation have brought you naught but blood and betrayal. Bah, he'll not hear us complaining. Twas a sight messier than expected, I, but we was still fighting for the freedom of all, just like we swore. Ain't ain't that right, mates? Ye babes. Hi. You humble me. I'm truly blessed to have such steadfast comrades. It is with the most profound regret, then, that I must... That's enough of that, Commander. We know what you've a mind to say, and we ain't having none of it. We've talked it over, see? And we all, we're all agreed. We can take our uniforms and strip us of our ranks. Oh, ye can take our uniforms and strip us of our ranks. We won't be no less of a company. Aww. You're our emotional support animal. <laughs> Crystal Braves may be finished, but the ideals upon the, upon which this company, which the company was founded, live on. They bind us together and to you. Commander, Alfino, our minds are made up, so you may as well get used to it. Let us help the Scions. Let us help you find Menphilia and the others. Ain't they dead, though? My friends. After all that has happened, I know not what to say. Aww. Pepper, put a hand on his shoulder. Don't just smile at him crying. Girl. Come on, girl. Oh, shit. Pray excuse me. I have thought my tears spent. My grandfather used to say that one can measure a man by the con the con the constancy the con the constancy the constancy by the constancy whatever of his comrades. Mayhap I am the exception which proves the rule. Nay, do not protest. I know that I am not worthy of their loyalty, Pepper. But as Thaliac is my witness, I shall do everything in my power to earn it. He was crying. He is baby. Alfino has matters to attend to at the Rising Stones. Well, we're here. I must speak a future plans with the remaining braves. Any information we uncover on the missing scions will need to be shared with our allies across the realm. Specifically, Urianje in the Waking Sands and Tataru in Ishgard. While we are organizing our various channels of communication, I would ask that you call upon Master Garland of the Manufactory. I will join you in Ishgard as soon as I am able. Thank God! Take me back! Take me home to the place I belong. Ish garden, ya. Um. Holy sea, mama. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. I know he's like over here somewhere, right? Yeah, I can probably just run. Well, I can run, babes. I can run. Oh, am I auto running? I am auto running. Right up here, right. Yeah, right over here. Right, oh shit, game, there we go. Let's see him in here. Yes. Pepper, how in the seven hells do you do it? I was just about to send for you. We have but this moment to be the Manicatter's first successful test flight. Look who it is! A few minor adjustments and she'll be ready to go. While we see to the finishing touches, you might want to pay a visit to Fortaunt Manor. A dragoon by the name of Estinian was looking for you. I got excited! I thought he was gonna say my boy is waiting for me. God damn it. 
I want my boy. I want my boy. Please give me my boy. I'm such a good singer, chat. I have the voice of an angel. And anyone who denies that, liars! Frauds! Let's see here, what's going on? <sighs> it's a combination of Fergie and Jesus. Fergie and Jesus. You know, I never thought that's what I'd be compared to, but I'm not necessarily complaining. So thank you. I will, I'll take Fergie and Jesus. All right, Estinian, my boy, my, my other boy. Hello? You have fulfilled your obligation to the old Dons then. To the old Dons then? There we go. Mr. Sitaru has been keeping me apprised of the situation. Once I learned that these mana cutters of Master Garland's were nearing completion, I saw no reason to tarry in the mist. For the present, Nidhogg seems content to remain in the airy, plotting his revenge. Might not this be an apt moment to unfold our plans to Sir em Emmerich? I think we have kept him in the dark long enough. You are absolutely right. Let's go see my other boy! My elven boys! My elven men! Ah, I wonder where you're going. I, I do a emote and I do a wave and then I do a okay well no you did not want to do anything <gasps> they waved at me too yay friendship <laughs> All right. hi sriracha what's up I seduce you with my singing good good Sriracha, how you doing? Wait, is that what I call you? Do I call you Sriracha? Or like, do I want me to call you like, S San? No, Sriracha San. Like, Sriracha San, right? Yeah. So Emmerich has been eager to speak with you. Pray proceed. All right. Show me my other boy. I love this gothic ass cathedral music. It's so good. All stands ready, Lord Commander. Sriracha's fine? Okay, good. I'm alright! We're playing Final Fantasy tonight. I'm going through more of the main story. It is getting mighty juicy. Uh, do you play Final Fantasy? Are you a Final Fantasy gamer? Or are you like Jay with zero taste? I forgot I have to buy Sriracha, but I kept thinking of Szechuan. Oh, you know what I want? I may not like fish, but this restaurant that I go to with my mom, they make really good breaded Szechuan fish. So good. Ugh. <sighs> The moment has come, then. Pray excuse my lateness. I paid a brief visit to the workshop to inquire about the mana cutters. The engineers assure me that they're ready. The area is now but a short flight away. Yet what a long and winding path we took to reach this point. Were it not for Master Alphino's proposal, we never would have attempted to parley with the dragons. Though our negotiations yielded little, our expedition with Lady Isar taught us much. Wow, he's being open? Hi, Sarnix! I'm gonna play this, should I try it? Absolutely. If you are into fantasy games and RPGs, I highly recommend trying Final Fantasy Online. You can play it for free. <coughs> Sorry. You can play the game for free. Um, I believe it goes up until the end of Heaven's Ward, which is what I'm playing right now. So that's like months, like literal months of gameplay. So yeah, I'm I'm selling it. I'm doing it. Let's get let's get the copy pasta in the chat. You mean the critically acclaimed MMORPG Final Fantasy fourteen? Yeah, it's free. It's free. Look that shit up. I will literally play with you. So. You just make a character, put it on crystal, or it doesn't matter where it is because I can still join you. But, yeah. <laughs> I would for sure resub for a Sire raid squad. 
I do at one point or at some point want to make an FC or something, and then we can all we can all be a part of it. <laughs> Damn it, I was typing that up from memory. Jay, you are an overachiever. Just copy and paste it, my dear. <laughs> yeah, yes, the three fantasies: Orshafont, Estinian, Sir Emmerich, and Ishtola. And that's about it for now. <laughs> what copy pasta? Do you mean the critically acclaimed MMO RPG Final Fantasy Online with an expanded free trial, which you can play through the entirety of a Realm Reborn and the award-winning Heaven's Word expansion up to level 60 for free? With no restrictions on playtime? If only there was an FC on Leviathan waiting for you with many friends. See, unfortunately, Jay, I'm stuck on Crystal Goblin because I said so. Y'all should come to Crystal Goblin! Excuse me. Don't pressure me to join Leviathan when I'm literally on the Sableye fucking server and shit. Okay? Okay? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Y'all ain't my friends. I can imagine you being the mascot for the game. I am. <laughs> you took an unimaginable <laughs> risk. I could scarce believe the tale Estinian told. I. Tis true that many of our countrymen would sooner die than join hands with the heretic's mistress. You know but who, was through that um, most Sir, unlikely of alliances that we came to speak with Reisvelger. Sir Emmerich's uh, right-hand lady reminds me of Brielle of Tarth from uh, Game of Thrones. A conversation that went rather poorly, as I recall. In this instance, the journey was more important than the destination. Had we not slain Nidhogg's consort, Tiamun, and put the Great Worm on his guard, the Dravanians would have arrived at Ishgard's walls long ago. You're welcome, Sriracha. One of us! One of us! One of us! Okay, but here's the question. Are you going to be a bunny boy, a cat girl, an Elizin, or a normie human? Or are you going to be a lion fellow, like a tiger lion man? What, what, what are the vibes? Oh... And then they'll have people in Sire costumes at all cons. Could you imagine? I would love to be the face of a character or something and then have people dress up as me. <laughs> There's so many choices. Mm -hmm. The customization isn't as grand as I would have hoped. Um, like, it's not incredibly in-depth, but, like, you can still make a super fucking cute character. I just saw a new Overwatch 2 statue of Reinhardt. Oh, wait... God, I can't, like, think of Reinhardt without thinking of my ex, and it drives me bonkers. <laughs> Let's see, Reinhardt. Like, that's all I associate Reinhardt with. It sucks. Because I used to main Reinhardt! Alright, where's the statue? Where's the statue? Yo! Oh no, it's a thousand dollars. Uh, I'm so tempted. I'm so tempted. I usually go because you Skyrim, so props cat girl. Yes! Cat girl army. Yes! Yes! I love Mikotes. They're so fucking cute. They are adorable. I love the cat peoples. Sometimes I forget this game is like 10 years old. It's come a long way. Yeah. I forget that too when I play it. <laughs> like it feels like I'm playing a new game, but I am not. All right. Let me focus on chat. Or on Aye, game. That they would. Full grateful am I for every hour of respite your actions Jesus afforded Waldo. us. Thanks to you, our defenses are much improved. Tis but a pity they won't be enough. Ayo, PMA! Thus, you believe an assault upon the area represents the city's best chance of survival. Is that not so, Astinian? I am under no illusions. Nidhogg's might is legendary. But with his eye in my possession, I can stifle his strength at the source. What is Hroth again? Is Hroth the lion people? 
I'm a sucker for row ladies, though. Row mommies are... Mm. I am not the biggest fan of hurrah. Like, I am in theory, but there's something about their, like, whoo, design that I'm not into. And Whittle Goblin, thank you so much for the raid. Hello, everybody. My name is Sarah. I'm a variety streamer. Currently, we're playing Final Fantasy Online. Get comfy. Get cozy. We're diving into the main story. We're getting sad. We're getting emotional. We're beating up dragons. We're doing cool things. And we're simping for boys. Hot Ellas and men. <laughs> Hrothgar, yes. The waha design, the hoo, the hoo. <laughs> Victory will be hard won, even so, and I shall be glad indeed to have the warrior of light at my side. You shall have my blade as well. There are more of these mana cutters to be had, yes? Lord Commander, no. How can I, a proud knight of Ishgard, stand by and do naught while an outsider risks life and limb for our homeland? Amen, King. I swore an oath to protect Morals, this city. baby. Morals. Let's go. Pray leave the slaying of dragons to dragoons, Sir Knight. Never mind. <laughs> Your duty to command the city's defense is no less vital. Is the cat girl or bunny girl race? The bunny girl race is Viera. Well, bunny girl, bunny boy, it's Viera. And cat girl, cat boy is... Or no gender on them, but the cat race is Mikote, the bunny race is Viera. I Should am we a fail meow meow. and Nidhogg slip through our grasp, who then will hold the walls against him? Will you leave Ishgard in the hands of the Holy Sea zealots? T. There are others. Who but you has the authority and the standing to orchestrate a city-wide defense? I do not, and neither does the Warrior of Light. That is why it is our place to fight, and yours to remain here, Lord Commander. Am I the only one slowly getting really attracted to Estinian? <laughs> is it just me? It, it can't just be me, right? Are, are we all... Are we all... Get, are, he, he's, a, he's a little spicy, right? Mm, you like my ears? Thank you. Yeah, there's a there's a little something about him that's got me a little bit uh funky wonky. I don't know. I don't really know what it is. Okay, there we go. I started as a dragoon, so Estinian has always been my favorite. Oh, hell yeah. He starts off as an edgy shithead, but he grows on you in good character development. Oh, I'm excited to see where he goes. What? You too, Master Alfino. By the fury. You have shown some promise, but this adversary is far beyond your skills. Daddy? <laughs> Protector of Alfino? Your candor is appreciated, Sir Dragoon. I shall remain then and cheer you from afar. Well, my friend, it would seem I have discouraged the last of the volunteers and claimed the task as ours alone. But if any alive can best this worm, tis surely we too. Mm. <laughs> she go, mm. <laughs> I'm very attracted to Estinian. He's a, he's a, hmm. I don't know what he looks like. I don't care what he looks like, but him. Sarnix, if you spawn, if you are here, I see you snapping your fingers. Yeah, there you are. Well, casually just chilling by the wall. Hi, did you want to join the, did you want to join the party, babes? Did you want to come with us, babes? Feeling funky wonky for that chunky monkey. Yeah, baby. Alfie and Alice they have some super malls that no one else can do in the game. Oh, they're small. Yeah, because they're they're young, right? They're supposed to be like 16. Oh shit, Vincent is the party leader. Vincent! Make me leader, babe! 
babes. Make me leader. I'm trying to invite somebody, babes. Thank you. <laughs> I like to think that if I yell loud enough, Vincent will hear me, even though I know he's watching the stream. I just like the idea that my voice travels so far in the game that my party members can hear me. All right, Estinian, what's up, babes? I've pricked Master... I've pricked Master Elfino's pride, I fear. But I, had I been less forceful, the boy would have insisted on accompanying us to the airy. Nothing me blind to his talent. With a few more campaigns under his belt, I have no doubt that Elfino will make a fine field commander. But one does not practice on an adversary such as Nidhogg. We shall be hard-pressed enough with the, without the added worry of carrying a novice. Okay, so I have a feeling that a battle is coming up. Am I right? Probably. We have tarried long enough. Let us call upon Master Garland and take possession of the mana cutters. Yee-hoi! Me hoi me nyoi. Hoi me nyoi me nyo me nyo. Do you have space for a DPS? Um, I guess so. I don't know if Vincent is DPC, PCP. <gasps> Hi, Vosk. Vosk, I love your hammer. I think I saw somebody else with the same hammer and it made me do a laugh. There's something about it that is just so good. Does it run dragon slaying? Apparently so. Definitely do the next level of quests. Well, I'm, well, I'm going to. Oh, there's Sid. Boss, did you want to- Mm-hmm, who just mm hmm in my ear? Hello? Did you want to join? Did- Did you want to- Oh, you're trying to crystal? Okay. Is it gonna be a, a light party or a full party? Does anybody know? I mean, I'm sure chat knows. Who is this? Light, four man? Okay. Light is four. Full is eight. Yeah, I know, but I didn't know if the next thing was going to be a light or a full party. I didn't, mean, I didn't mean how much. Hello, Sonic. Say you are, babes. Yeah, that's what I meant. I didn't I didn't know what it's going to be. It's four? Yeah. I, 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 I give you, I give you hug. What is it? Damn, the lightning is nuts today. I hug. I do. I do a hug. Eh. I can tank her DPS? Cool. Well, I know Sarnix can heal. I don't mind tanking, but I think I would rather deeps. Stop hugging his crotch? I can't help it. Wait, no, now he's at my level. Hold on. Wait, no, go back to my level. Go back to my level! <laughs> Excuse me. A name that hammer Pepto? I know, right? Yay! I reach! <laughs> Sitting in queue? Oh, hopefully it's not too long. Okay, so I think Lulu... Do you prefer being called Lulu or Kelsey? I think Kelsey's gonna join us, and I think she said that she's going to DPS, so her and I will deeps. And then... Um, Vincent, you can tank, and Sarnix, you can heal? Okie dokes. right proper raid leader look I do my best I do my best for my children this is Lulu and Kelsey's like Richard and Dick 
In what way is that like choosing between Richard and Dick? Do I sit in bed with stream open, try to stay up, or do I straight up pass out? You hang out with us. You pass out to stream. That's what you do. You pass out while watching me. All right, that is your only option. Lulu, is that you? No. Or maybe that is, I don't know. Oh, that is you! Wait, is it? Wait. Where? 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 Where are you? Where are you? I'm assuming that's you? Is that you, Lulu? Who said hi to me? But I can be. You can be? Is that you? Did I invite some random fucking person? Did I did I invite a random? Was I was I baited? Oh, that's you? Okay, good. Okay. Whew! Whew! Okay. We're good. We're good. <laughs> All right, Vosk. Cheer for me on the sidelines, my dear. The finer adjustments cost us a few sleepless nights, but we got there in the end. Which means you can get where you need to go. I tell you, these little beauties will tear through that windbird like a sermet drill through cottage cheese. I'm sleepy as ass, like a really sleepy ass. One that like broke into your house, ate all the po ate all your potpourri, and trashed your living room and passed out. Fuck yeah, that's my kind of ass. All right, here we go. Shit's about to get real. I think I'm excited. Oh my god. Oi 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 Bing bong boom along What? The Aries now accessible babes Da na 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 Do 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 should have a poop check for the bowels. Very important. We should have poop checks. Uh, excuse me. Everybody go to the bathroom real quick and see if you have to shite. Ooh, burble. Done him with the <laughs> How does Pepper just know how to fly this? <laughs> Where is this, Dinian? <laughs> uh, Stinian? My boy? <laughs> you, guys, you guys are so cute. Yay! Okay, let's go, let's go. Oh wait, hold on, let me eat some food.
I coming. Pepper's coming. Hello, game. Thank you. So loud, it go boom. She has her driver's license. <laughs> You're right, how could I have forgotten when I took the driving test? Oh, we're doing a big pull, are we? Okay, Vincent, I see you. Big dick energy, okay. Fat pull. Music is so so nice. Oh hello. Oh hello. Maybe I should have stayed closer. Okay, my bad. Maybe I should have paid attention. Question mark? Oh, I did not mean to fucking do that. I am but a fool. I know the aesthetic of it all is pleasing me. Um, so if I get attached to it, do I just run like a mad woman? Oh my god! Bring tethers to towers? Okay, cool, thank you. What's in here? What's in here? What's in here? What do I get? What do I get? I will take that. I guess. Ah! <laughs> My bad. It's all good. I don't care. No, I don't care, Sonic. You're fine. I'm sure at some point I'll do this again. Oi. Oh, so do we not trouble the sleeping dragon? You guys don't want to fight it? I want to fight it. Well, what if I go solo it? Then what? Then what? Then what are you gonna do, huh? Oh my god, I love tentacles. Yeah, you do! Yeah, you do! You know what? At least you're being honest with yourself now. I'm really proud of you. I know it's been really difficult. Game? Hope you like dragons? Well, it's a good thing I fucking do. Too bad I'm killing them all. Oh. 
go alone, you get spanked? Oh, then I guess I'm gonna go in alone. <laughs> Alright, well, the dragon is awake now, so... My wish has been granted. Hey, I didn't make it! I did- that was not me! That was- that was not me! No, 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 Sarnix! No, 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 <laughs> okay. Hi, cat. Are those dragon girl? Are those dragon girlfriends? They are, but they're dead now. So I mean, oh, this is so fucking pretty. Okay, this may be my favorite dungeon slash raid. Love. Hi, Zoe. What's up? I have not heard uh, that song by FK. FKA. But I should. I should listen to it. Wait, why didn't my thing go off? Mustard gas? I too am mustard gas. Let it eat a few clouds before killing? What does that mean? Let it eat a few clouds? Oh, the mustard gas. Orthodox tricorn of oh that is horrendous but I will take the earrings I guess what's it only keeps getting better and better along with the music you might run into a few not so great ones just only if you compare to how many good ones are yeah I mean so far every single dungeon I've done has been quite enjoyable except for one it's that like um, pseudo Egyptian one with the heads that glow I hate that one. I hate tanking in that one, I should be clear. And most of the time I've done it, I've tanked, so. Oi! Don't look part 14. Yeah, someone give Kat the TLDR for Final Fantasy 14. Oh sh I fucking I always do that. Sure cast is my favorite ability. Pat, have you played a Final Fantasy game? This is, um, bluntly my first one, so. Meh. You have not? Welcome to the team, baby. Oh, Kelsey, this is your first one too? Hell yeah. Newbie gang.
Holy shit, look at them all. Game? Okay. There we go. The dragons are good, but they're also bad. <laughs> Basically. Good night, calm night. Take care. Ooh, look at that. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh shit. Oh my god. If he dies, I swear to god. I, oh, no, 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 no. Don't take the hot man away from me. Oh my god. Ooh, flashbang. Oh, is Estinian gonna fight with us or is he just gonna hold that damn eyeball? Estinian's vitality? Oh, fuck. What happened? What happened? Oh! I didn't know it was spawning stuff. I couldn't see it from its big juicy ass. It was in the way. I'm so sorry, Sarnix! Such unthinkable power. I must use the eye to shield us. Yes, do a shield. Did I level up? I think I did. Oh, the music just got so much louder. Why? Where'd the big boy go? Where'd the big boy go? Come back, come back. I'm not done with you, babes. There's not, that's not him. Good God, that was so fast. Oh, who this? This Oshk. <laughs> Shoot us with a fireball? What is happening here? Oh! That's a good thing I went in there. It's not, it's not letting me. Oh, we're good. Oh, he ain't even dead. He just fucking flew away. He said, fuck all of y'all. Yeah. You gonna do the- are you gonna do the cat thing? You shouldn't do the cat thing. Sometimes when we finish stuff, she goes, yeah. <laughs> That's really fucking cute. I did it! We did it! Alright, what's the loot? What's the loot situation? My spell? I'ma take that and I'ma take this too, cause why not? We did it! Yay! <laughs> Hi, Captain. What's up? This game kind of reminds me that I need to hurry up and beat Skyrim. Yes! You need to start playing Skyrim again! I remember when you were keeping us updated on your Skyrim shenanigans. They were fucking hilarious. Oh. Oh, fuck. He's coming. Good God. Yes. 
Justinian's armor is all fucked up. Holy shit. Estinian, if you're okay, give me a thumbs up. Please and thank you. My voice cracked, I'm sorry. Whoa! Gotta get it in there. Oh! Yo, his armor is literally stained crimson, like he said. Oh fuck, he exploded. You gifted my people a thousand years of suffering. Now I gift you an eternity in darkness. Wait, I can see more of his face now. Oh. Oh shit, am I getting another one? Am I getting another crystal? Fucking flashback. <laughs> uh, Omega Lone Wolf, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome to come to your badger most and your stay. Thank you. I got three crystals back now. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba We're making progress. I'm doing the thing. <laughs> Not the crimson chin. Einstein is now the crimson chin. Oh my god, I'm getting a vision. I haven't had one of these in a while. An echo or whatever. Oh, is that that friend of Isail's? I forgot his name. Marsashamp? Is that Estinian? I recognize the... No, that's not Estinian. They are ours, Lord Eldrath. The eyes of Nidhogg. Or is it? No, it's not. It's not. Aye. The worm lies broken and my father is avenged. With the wellspring of his vitality thus denied him, Nidhogg shall not linger long in this world. But behold, the terrible price we have paid. My sire is dead. So many brother knights slain. We traded our honor for the strength which now courses in our veins. And still we are forced to make such sacrifice. But not in vain, my lord. Trace Felger is the only great worm left in Dravania, and he dares not leave his lair. With Nidhogg's eyes in your possession, who now can challenge the might of Ishgard, ascend the throne, and take your rightful place as the ruler of our people? Nay, my friend. I must forsake the mantle of king. Though Nidhogg be defeated, his wormling horde yet darkens the skies with wings beyond counting. Wait, I'm so confused. As one who partook of Ratatoska's strength, 
Defeated. It shall be my penance to bear a knight's arms until death grants me leave to retire. But Lord Haldreth, what then shall become of the royal line? Think of your people, my lord. Without a king, who will the common man turn to in his hour of need? How will he find his way without your benevolent hand to guide him? I thank you, Sir Flavian and Sir Silvertrill, for dispelling my remaining doubts. With men of such wisdom and compassion in service to the realm, it is plain that Ishgard yeah, has no that, need Simon, of a king. I figured that. But if you must bow to the demands of tradition, it took you me need a look second. no further than yourselves for one worthy to wear the crown. I'm just... But then... But they didn't kill Nidhogg. That... Wasn't that the sister that they... I don't know. Because didn't we just fight Nidhogg? Fare thee well, my brother knights. My loyal friends. On these shoulders shall I bear the weight of my but father's sins. But we just fought him and he had one eye. With this... Oh shit. Fuck! I don't know what he said. Damn it. My finger hit the button. What cruel jest has fate played upon us? Have we seized this desperate victory only to lose a king? But we just fought Nidhogg and Nidhogg had one eye. They just took two of Nidhogg's eyes. And didn't Estinian, yeah, didn't Estinian have Nidhogg's eye? We can but act as our lord has been. I'm, I think that we like, few who remain it's must not Nidhogg they fought, the that was the sister, right? The brood sister because they murdered her? Is this the retelling of that? But I thought it was like Lord Thornton or... Not I. I. I don't know. My oath was to Lord Haldreth and he alone. If he is not to be king, then I would hang up my shield as well. Will you abandon us too, sir? I would wash my hands of blood and betrayal and take up an honest trade. Mayhap I shall serve ale instead of sharp and steel. Bold. Bold. I want to be a tavern wench. We four, then. Fortan, Hylanath, Durandair, and Zemile. But four houses to rule all of Ishgard. And what of the throne? We keep it empty. Until the day a king rises once more, we must assume the role of stewards. We shall shape our nation anew with a history of our own making and let the truth of this dark day die here upon the battlefield. Okay. Oh, my booby! What ails you, friend? Are you wounded? Or did I not fight Nidhogg? You have borne witness to history. To the culmination of the first battle with Nidhogg. The legend of Ishgard's founding tells that our ancestors were led to the land of Kurthus by the valiant King Thordon. In the midst of their journey, they came to a wide chasm where they were set upon by a great worm, Nidhogg. A furious battle then ensued, with Thordon leading the van. Though the brave king was slain defending his people, his son, Haldrath, the first Azure Dragoon, fought on undaunted. Ah, uh, okay. 
and with a mighty thrust of his lance, he gouged out Nidhogg's eye, forcing the wicked creature into retreat. Okay. Thus, did this eldritch orb become a sacred treasure of Ishgard, lending its power to every knight deemed worthy to bear the title uh, of Azure Dragoon. Okay. So it's considered like a relic then to them. A rousing tale, is it not? Would that I could still believe it. I guess. But your vision, which we must accept as immutable truth, leaves no room for doubt. Save on one point. If Haldreth took both of Nidhogg's eyes, then how came this eye to be lost oh! in the Oh! Wait a second! Wait! Pause, pause, pause! Pause, 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 pause! It's coming together! Uh, Hrael Smilgar had one eye as well, and it was the opposite eye, because he, Hrael Smilgar was missing this eye, Nidhogg was missing this eye, and it's yellow like Hrael oh, Hrael Smilgar gave him an eye! Gave him an eye! He gave him an- <coughs> He gave him an eye! I pieced it together the way they pieced his eyes together. I've solved it. Yes, indeed. <laughs> With every answer we unearth, another question lies buried. Asinian, I just told you. I, I just solved the riddle. I figured it out. Pepper, stop him. You know. Pepper. Peppa. I'm not looking at chat. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. <laughs> Twas a fierce I'm almost battle, certain one that's I knew it. We would win. Your fame is well deserved, warrior of light. Full proud am I to have fought at your side. I would fain return with all swiftness to Ishgard to inform the Lord Commander of our triumph. Not. But we must first have words with Hreisvelger. There are parts of this tale that the worm has kept from us, and I would know wherefore. Are we going to confront him about the eye? <laughs> Alright. Though Nidhogg has fallen, my heart is yet heavy, and the stain of corruption pleases me not. And when all has been put to rest, I must needs forge my armor anew. Thank you, uh, valid login ID for this sub. Welcome to your bedroom house and your stay. I got the mana cutter key. Sick. What does that do? Does that is it a mount now? Yeah, I thought so. With Nidhogg fallen, none save Harisvelgar remains to answer our questions. Let us trouble the worm again. And if Iceheart yet lingers at Zenith, all the better. I would have her hear the truth from the dragon's maw. Okay. Here we go, babes. We're about to figure it out, and then I can look at chat. I don't want. I don't want chat telling me anything. I don't want chat guiding me. I don't want chat. To uh, tell me if I'm right or wrong, you know? I'm pretty sure I solved it. Because I clocked that. I remember. I was like, hmm. Bracebook has one eye. Interesting. Then I saw Nid God and I was. N N what was his name? Nid. Gog. I forgot. Nidhog. And I was like, hmm. One was red, one was yellow. Bracebook has a yellow eye. Hmm. It's all coming together. Yes, I'm figuring it out indeed. Indubitably. All right, monkey. Actually, no, let's use the horse. Let's go, babes. Take me up the babes. Let's go, let's go. On delay, on delay. Are you all waiting for me up there? I think Kelsey is. Kelsey, are you just vibing at the top? Oh! Nope, you're behind me. You were behind me. That's where you were. I saw you running around. I was like, what is going on here? This was you, was it not? The furious screams the dragons carried afar. You have slain Nidhogg. What more would could you desire from this place? Will you not allow Hraisvalgar to mourn the death of his kin in peace? 
Spare us your sanctimonious judgment. I made it. What's up, guys? Edgy boy! I call my PP the neat hawk. Yeah, you wanna knit that hog, baby? Thank you for the 100 bits, Edgy boy. We have a gift for the Great Worm, and a mystery that can no longer lie buried. Lady Iceheart, the Dragon Song War has all but consumed your life and claimed many of your followers. Tis time you learn the truth of its beginning, the whole truth, though you may at last bring this bitter conflict to an end. Sound the horn, warrior of light. Do, 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 do. Girl, how do you know how to play that tune? Tell me. If that were me, I'd just go <laughs> like <laughs> I ain't playing no songs. Oh, he coming. Oh la, he coming. Oh la, he coming. See? He's got the one eye. Bada boopy, bada bada bing bong. I got it. Big jeans for 20, thank you for the prime sub. I appreciate you. I'm coming for a minute. This is my name. This is my name. This is my name. You mean the moment I prized your eye from his head? Yes! 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 Tell him, bitch! Tell him! Yahoo! Oh! I got it. Yeah, you've been thwarted. <laughs> but, like, how did you do that? Did you get, like, a tooth angle? Take your eye back. Oh. Oh, it just. It just swoop in there, just like that. It just go. Oh, look how handsome you look now. Oh, does this mean you're back to your full strength? Oh. Ooh. <gasps> Right. Oh, is this gonna be an echo of like it happening? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Ratatas, Ratatatata, is that the sister? Yeah. Oh, his like face is all scratched, I think. Come on, do the eye reveal. Oh. Yeah, look at that. Is fair. That is fair. Your blindness is what led them to this, all these shenanigans. So give me an eye, baby. Goddamn. Ben, thank you for the 11 month reset. Appreciate it. Please. 
Okay, next time I get a Samiad, I'm naming it Race Vulgar. Like, just. Waldo, are you my Horace Vulgar? Yeah, you are. Horace Vulgar, Vulgar, Velg. God, I love their horns. The horn details are lovely. How do they just do this? How do they just do this? Mm, look at what you done. That's so fucking cool. This is so fucking cool. If I get flashbanged again, I swear to god. <laughs> Oh, did she see it too? Yeah. She it got was the echo, yours. Right? Your strength that sustained Nidhogg all these years. Would that Haldreth had dealt the worm a killing blow. And so you acquiesced. You surrendered your what eyes to Nidhogg, knowing full well the suffering he would inflict. This he fell in love with an Ellison. <laughs> I mean, good. I want to know that dragons can fall in love with humanoids like myself, but goddamn, bro. <laughs> He's like, your people, your people. Well, why did you fall in love with an Ellison? Why did you eat her up? Why did you gobble gobble her? <laughs> God damn. Well... That was something. Who the? What the? Who the? What the? What in the? What? What is this? What is going on? Are you all just fluttering around me on dragons? <laughs> it's a mating dance. Ah, oh, yes. Thank you for the fitty bitties. I appreciate it so much. Wow! All right. Okay. So it's a mating thing. All right. Let me perform my um, my mating dance. Ah yes. Ah yes. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Kick up, up, up. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Ooh ee ooh ah. Excuse me. You left the circle. Now the mating ceremony won't work. Oh. You're joining me. Oh, I see. Oh, oh, are we all doing the mating dance now? Uh, oh, no, you've passed away. You have passed away. You know, it's a worthy sacrifice. Someone had to die in order for my baby to come out. Oh, wait, what's that? Is the baby coming? Baby's coming. Or baby's not coming. Oh, baby came. There's the baby. And yes, I did give birth to a baby. A baby dragon, I know. I'm a... <gasps> 
Oh my god, you're so cute. Alessandro, I love you. You got your, you got your satchel. No, it's a chocobo. I cannot fall for your, for your chocobo ways. Okay, wait, Isail, let me speak to you. I want to see what you're saying. And thus did betrayal beget unending vengeance. By the way, yes, Arnix? Notice something? Yes, you're wearing Estinian's armor, are you not? Uh, oh. I'm sorry, is that ass- No, come back! That ass was jiggling in my face! I wanted to stare at the booty. And in unison, yeah, that was beautiful. Estinian's frustrated by yet another mystery. Grim! I am in the middle of- Oh, can I- can I- Oh, yes, give it- put it in my face, in my face. In my face, you gotta come where Estinian is. Come on, come on, come, 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 come. <laughs> a little, little back a bit, back it up, back it up, back it up a little bit. <laughs> God damn, that's a lot of booty. That's a lot of jiggly booty on my screen. Oh my God damn, it looks like they're about to pop out of shit. <laughs> My booty don't jiggle jiggle, it folds. Shit, what'd he say? I don't know, something is vexing him. Look up for more booty. God, well god damn it! Twas my life's goal to slay Nidhogg. But I find there is little joy to be had in its accomplishment. But you have rid the world of a hate-filled creature. And ended a bloody war in so doing. I lost my family to Nidhogg's flames. And t'was with fury in my heart that I took up the lance. Every blow I struck, I struck in the name of vengeance. Just like him. We were not so different, yeah. he and I. I will not judge you for your deeds. I have not the right. Too many innocents have perished in the name of my greater good. They're finally finding common ground. Hi, Gregory. What's up? Yet even with all that has passed, the tale is incomplete. We are short a great worm's eye. Of the pair which Haldrith took from Nidhogg, only one is known to us. The one I bear. What then became of the other? Oh, fuck. Why, Why am I scared? Nidhogg, who had taken such pains to Hi, prolong Jay. the Dragonsong War, suddenly What's decide that? to hurl his entire army against the walls of Ishgard. Now oh, we're getting a link pearl. Lord Commander. Aye. The deed is done. Nidhogg is slain. What? In the city? A battle with whom? At once, Lord Commander. Hold firm till our return. Fighting has broken out in the city. Lord Emmerich was sparse with the particulars, but it seems some commoners threw open the gates to a force of heretics. Oh, fuck. I gave no order to attack. Are we to mark the end of the Dragon Song War by spilling the blood of our own? Mayhap Praiseworthy was right about us. Let us away, Warrior of Light. The people must be saved from themselves. Yes. Oh, we zoom. Wait! I would join you! Oh? You're gonna help our there cause? There has been enough violence. I will appeal to my people in the city and make them see reason. She looks like she got frostbite. <laughs> Hi, Phantom Rush, what's up? I know there are some, I think, a couple new people in here. Um, I then, was not paying Lady attention to Ice chat. Heart. Let us write the final chapter in this damnable war. The ship has sailed. I know I wasn't paying attention to chat because I was really enraptured with the story, but hi, friends. I hope everyone is enjoying um, this gripping tale. And I was also paying attention to booty. Yes, it's true. Can you blame me, though? <laughs> oh, fuck. The ship has he sailed. Ha <laughs> ha! Good one. Oh, it's the fucking Pope. 
A small army of heretics has invaded the city, Your Eminence. But there is no cause for concern. A sizable contingent of our soldiers is already in place to repel the Dravanian assault. And the intruders will soon find themselves outnumbered and outmatched. Our plans proceed apace, then. Yes, Your Eminence. This unrest shall serve to feed the people's fear. I think my my dog needs water. Hold both. on. Fucking scared the shit out of me. Oh my god, ruining my immersion. Um, remember when I followed I too surprised to see people to see someone playing on Goblin, not to say hi though. Aw, well hello Remy Scarlet. <laughs> hi baby boy. I think he actually may need to pee, so I'm gonna lead you all leave you all with the Pope. I will be right back. Yes, Boobaloo.
Hello. We're back. And I am so jealous of Waldo always having really good treats. I feel like I need to go buy some frickin' some food. I really want to make more mac and cheese. Can I make more mac and cheese? It'll only take two seconds. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. I'll be back. I just gotta like put it in the microwave and then weighs a solid 10 pounds yeah this is a pope stream it's no longer a cyrus stream i'm so sorry everybody had to find out this way oh man it's so like muggy outside that i feel like my chest is like in so much pain like i feel so like ah. i don't know how to describe it Yeah, it's really humid. Don't scroll up in chat. Okay, I won't scroll up in chat. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Ontario is hell. Europe is hell. The entire universe is going to shits. All right, the cat ears are back on. That means it's Mikote time. Did my camera get higher? I don't know. About the Pope and his hair. Do you think he's bald, chat? You think he's balding like J3? Uh. And lend renewed fervor to their prayers for deliverance. Not downstairs. Oh no! Very <laughs> good. The crown here. Grant our guests what time they need to sow a measure of chaos, then order the temple knights to crush them. Your will be done. Are these guys all Asians? Do you think it's round table or all Asians? No. They're not. I'm just overthinking. Hi, Seaheart. <laughs> Mr. Dell, thank you for the prime sub. I appreciate it. This is ominously qua ha ha ha. The moment is at hand. Slahabrea. Hello. Excellent. All S shall soon be in alignment. Man, I, I can't tell who he's double crossing. It is time for the bringer of light to die. Uh, nor... Unfortunately, I am not dying. Is someone got a bum bum? Hold on. I hope he doesn't move. Oh fuck, there's a cutscene. Shit, I wanted to show you guys Waldo's butt. He's letting me just scratch him. He looks really cute. My boy! Love of my life! Hi, sweet boy! What? 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 Hi! It me! It me! My boy! We go into battle with my boy! My boy! Oh god, we zoom. Shed. My heart is pounding so much right now. I feel like I can't breathe. My lady. My lady. 
She is calm. <laughs> well, at some point we all were. Hear me, brothers and sisters. The war is ended. Nidhogg is no more. Aye, it is so. This adventurer and the Azure Dragoon laid the great worm low. Oh, I just noticed his um helmet also is broken, I think. I just noticed that. The endless cycle of violence between man and dragon was born of our forefathers' treachery. You have followed me, bled with me, to bring this truth to light that we might all know peace. But Nidhogg is dead. Nidhogg is dead, my friends! He who bore such hatred towards Ishgard is dead! Let his hatred die with him, I say! Let us sheathe our swords and go in peace! Have we lost? No, my friend. Far from it. At long last, the peace for which we have so desperately fought is within our grasp. And I, for one, would not forsake it. My microwave is calling me. I don't mean to interrupt this tense moment, but I do not want it to continue screaming. me if you'd like i may accept i may not i may forget to <laughs> peace well it's not in the middle of my cutscene come on look at my boy i can't stop looking at my boy he's so handsome seize the witch let none escape but we're done. Providing aid and succor to the wounded should be our first concern. Mm-hmm. Tell him, King. If the heretics mean to observe the peace, then it would be folly not to do the same. You tell him, sweet boy! You tell him! cheese I love him I love him so much I would die for him I love him I would let myself go up in flames for my boy I love my sweet sweet good boy that was rather too close for comfort but would seem that calm is returned to the streets my mind however yet clamors with a thousand questions you return to Ishgard in the oddest of company my friend you don't have to call me friend anymore. It's okay. You can tell everybody that we're getting married. It's fine. Ooh, this armor is quite n Hello? Wait a fucking second. Hold on. And I'm pretty sure I could do a die test, right? Enable die preview. Um. Oh. Oh. It's like, it's nice. But like, I don't, I don't know. 
I don't know if it's nice enough for my taste. Hold on, let me see the gold. Or the brass, rather. Ooh, the brass is actually kind of nice. Do I take the silver pieces or do I take this? I will take it. Fuck it. Eh, eh, eh. My boy, my boy, my sweet, lovely boy, 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 boy. Lord Orshavan has more than a few questions to ask. Oh. You have more than a few questions to ask? Mm. Well, I have a bunch of answers for you, baby. That, my friends, is our too close for comfort. Praise Halone that things do not end in bloodshed. I confess, I was more than a little dismayed to see you in the company of Lady Iceheart. Whatever is going on, Pepper? Beg pardon? You traveled to the Churning Mist together? Along with Estinian? Never was there a more unlikely alliance, nor one so magnificently effective. Nidhogg, dead. The heretics, pacified. Father and Sir Emmerich must know of this. Let us break the news to them together. I will bring Sir Emmerich to Fortaunt Manor. Hmm. Yes, an excellent suggestion. Very well. Pepper and I shall await you there. Eee! I go with my baby. We're going together. Oh, he's leaving without me. Well. 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 I got something on my glasses. Wow. Thank you for showering me with pedals. Is that because I just got married? Thank you. Here comes the bride. All dressed in paper. <laughs> Sorry, do you want me to reinvite you? Oh, a trade? <gasps> what is going on? I got in the Shiba hunting hawk can aesthetics. I give you one gill, babes. Thank you. Who is this? Who is this? Wait, Gregory, is this the Gregory that's in my chat right now? Gregory, is that you, babes? Thank you, babes! Oh, you fucking... <laughs> I have new minions? I got a little sheep minion. Oh, that's really cute. And I have a hawk now? That's cute. I kind of like the hawk. I'm going to roll with the hawk for a little bit. Um, okay, so we have to go to the manor, right? Alright. Gregory, thank you for those. That was very sweet of you. Mm. Oh! My mac and is really hot. <laughs> My mac and cheese is very hot. Let me in, babes! Let me in! Welcome, Mistress Mint. Shall I let you inside the manor? Yes! For making me. For not making me some mac and cheese. I'm so sorry, babes. I'm sorry. <gasps> Praise Halone, you are safe. My safety was never in doubt, Father, for I had the Azure Dragoon and the Warrior of Light by my side. We bring the most wonderful tidings. I love his PMA. I love him so much. I love him. He. Oh, he gone now. Oh, he moment. Oh, he the infamous Lady Iceheart here in Ishgard. This is most unexpected. She has done much to quell the violence. The Inquisition may not approve, but we are glad of her presence. And with the Great Worm's demise, even our nation's more reactionary elements will have scant grounds to press for her immediate impeachment. My thoughts exactly. Ooh! What of the truth revealed to us by Hreisvalga? 
that the origins of the Dragon Song War, a core tenet of Vishgardian faith, are quite unlike those depicted in the scriptures. Do they even care? That men and dragons once lived together in harmony, and that it was man's treachery which shattered the peace and plunged our peoples into war. The same scripture also describes the origins of the High Houses. Were it exposed as false, the legitimacy of our rule would be called into question. Too much drama? If both Highborn and Lowborn can trace their ancestry to Thorden and his knights, twelve. But a single sip of dragon's blood is required to confirm their lineage. If the Holy See knew of this and chose to remain silent, their crimes are grievous indeed. Regardless, this state of affairs cannot be allowed to continue. Sir Emmerich, you cannot mean to raise this matter with the Archbishop. Oh, fuck. Pray consider what you are proposing. If the Holy See chose to conceal the truth for centuries, what reason would they have to reveal it now? At best, you will be branded a heretic in Clapton Irons. Then at least the Archbishop will have shown his true colors. My friends, this war will never truly be at an end until the truth is made known. You must see what lies on the horizon if it is not. When ruled by fear of a common enemy, we were united. But now we have none. During the war, the highborn needed men to lead and the lowborn men to follow. Not anymore. Tis but a matter of time before the old order is called into question. Lady Iceheart will share the truth with her followers, and the Holy See will be powerless to stop its spread. The disenfranchised will rise up united, and blood will flow in the streets once more. So, we're not getting a happy ending, is what I'm hearing. A divided Ishgard will not survive. I am fucking the mac and cheese up. Listen. It's so good. It's extra cheesy too. Like triple cheese. Mm. Thank you, Scarlet. That's very sweet of you. I appreciate that offer. I'll have to take you up on that. Tread carefully, Lord Commander. Oh god. More fucking drama. What do I expect though? Is it just is that just craft? It is. It's just KD. My lady, is it wise to let him go? I sympathize with the Lord Commander's desire for reform, but to approach the Archbishop in this manner bespeaks an idealism to which I did not think Sir Emmerich prone. No, oh, shit, no! Almost pressed the wrong button. Fuck. Though he comports himself as a realist, he has long dreamt of reform. It was that idealism which first drew me to him, that which made me swear an oath to serve. We must not think of ways to hinder his cause, but rather ways to aid it. Even should the Holy See cry heresy. You cannot mean. If the Lord Commander does not return from the vault at the appointed hour, I mean to go and fetch him. Have care, my lady. Your words border on treason. Should they reach the wrong ears, you will be declared an enemy of Ishgard. That is a risk I am willing to take. Lest you forget, my lord, I am not born of this land. My loyalty is to the Lord Commander alone. She is literally giving Brielle of Tar. She is literally. Oh, thank you, Atka. Um, sorry, chat. Uh, my like uh, throat flare up is like coming in again. I just need to go to the bathroom and check on my gums, and um, just grab some Vicks to. Soothe my uh soothe my throat. I'll be right back. Oh god. Hate it here. <laughs>
Okay, I'm back. So, for those of you that don't know, um, I have some pretty bad gum issues. Um, so because of that, at least lately, I've been getting a ton of, um, like, pain in my, like, furthest back molar. Um, because of how deep my gums are, food gets stuck in them very, very, very easily. And so it gets puffy and everything gets irritated. Um, so I have tooth pain right here. I should fucking numb it. I'm an idiot. I forgot. Give me one sec. now i'm back now i'm back so yeah so i have gum pain and so it's it's really irritating especially when i'm streaming because sometimes it can give me a migraine and when i'm talking obviously it hurts because i can feel it so sometimes i do have to take a couple of breaks every so often you know it's 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 sucky but we're okay Gum pain? Yeah, like my peri peridon periodontis or whatever it is. Periodontitis. I don't remember what it's called. Okay, let me just fix my, my hair. Let me fix my hair, babes. Let me cover the band. The illusion. Take ibuprofen? I do! I do have to take another pill in a bit, though. It lets you stream longer, take as many breaks as you need. Thanks, Lulu. But I speak yeah. only of what may come to pass. If the rumors regarding his heritage are to be believed, we have naught to fear. Seeing the dentist next week, I can't just make last-minute appointments, unfortunately. It's not a thing. Plus, it'll cost me, like, $300, even though I'm seeing them next week, which is another, like, $300, $400, so it's not worth it. <laughs> Lies and slander. Hey, yo, he's got eye bags. He's hot. Forgive me, what rumors are these? That Sir Emmerich is the Archbishop's bastard son. What? Senior clergy are not permitted to marry and sire what? children. But even the holiest among us are not immune to temptation. Shut the fuck up. I labor the to Pope believe gets it. asked? Sir Emmerich is truly the Archbishop's son. He has never been publicly acknowledged as such. But the rumors have plagued him since childhood. That he rose to his current position, despite being despised as a bastard and accused of profiting from his father's influence, bespeaks the quality of his character. Oh my god. It is my hope that on this occasion, the burden of his birth will work in his favor. Should our worst fears be realized, the Archbishop will not be so quick to execute his own flesh and blood, affording us time to mount a rescue. I'm scared. Bastard or trueborn, he is our nation's best hope. If the Holy See dares to threaten him, I shall lead the charge against the vault myself. Hear, hear. The future of Ishgard rests on Sir Emmerich's shoulders. I too will do mine utmost to aid his cause. That's my boy. Orshafon, be reasonable. A knight lives to serve, father. To aid those in need. 
The people need Sir Emmerich more than ever, and we may be his only hope. There is no greater calling for a knight than to save the life of his fellow man. I swear to you, on the sigil of our house, that I shall do this and make you proud. Sweet boy. You make me papa proud. <laughs> Even uh. you? <laughs> Romantic, reckless fools, the lot of you. So be it. Make your preparations. I thank you all for your support. Why did I think she was gonna say more there? <laughs> Alright, let me um, make it a little bit cooler in my office. It is a little bit warm now that I'm cozied up. What a guy. What a Chad. He is a Chad. That's my boy! That's my boy! I'm a baby boy. I'm a baby boy. Okay, all good now. Okay, I'm going down to my boy. Sorry, do I have your permission to put chat into emote only at certain points just as a precaution? Um, I would say yes, Sarnix. I just saw what you said and I'm going to say it out loud. That might be a really good idea. Um, I doubt chat is going to be reckless. I don't know what's coming. It could be a good idea. Are y'all down for that? Just to start spamming emotes whenever Sarnix says to spam emotes? UVCW, thank you for the five month reason. I appreciate it. Welcome back to my Yeah? Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. We'll go into emote only mode then whenever i obviously don't want spoilers I, I know the final fantasy community is really good about not giving spoilers and i know this because i've been playing this game for a really long time on stream and to my knowledge barely an issue barely maybe a couple people here and there who will you know say like one or two things but it's usually pretty good which i am grateful for um but sarnix um or any of the mods let me know when to not look at notifs and stuff. Because, like, I can mute them as well. Actually, in fact, I'm going to do that right now. I hope you guys don't mind. But because a lot of this game is getting a little bit more intense, I don't really want to hear my alerts screaming in my ear during, like, cutscenes. So I'm going to I'm gonna have them muted right now. Yeah, I mean, me too, Mango. For the most part, I am... I'm very pleased with the Final Fantasy community, Final Fantasy Online community. Very, very pleasantly surprised by them. Okay, so I don't think I have any better gear. Oh, I do. Oh wait, those are cute. But unfortunately, I must go back to my good old reliable. My boy! Have no fear, father. My arm will not falter. My shield will not break. I promise you, we shall prevail. Oh, he's so PMA. I need that in my life. My boy! Their assistance is most welcome. I fear it will not be enough. Few as we are, we will struggle to reach the Lord Commander. If we are to succeed, we must needs recruit others to our cause. Okay. Oh, I got legs. Dragon skin breeches? Wait. Those are kind of sick. I mean, the colors are horrendous, but they're kind of dope. Should I cop any of them? Nah, let me just get the silver pieces. Oh, I'm only mode, okay. But how are we to carry out this bold endeavor, even with an army of knights at our backs? A direct assault on the vault seems unlikely to succeed. You are correct, Master Alfino. Not even the assembled might of House Fortom and the Temple of Knights would be sufficient. <laughs> with the support of another party, however, we may yet stand a chance. You speak of one of the other higher houses? Precisely the opposite. I speak of the revolutionaries rumored to reside in the broom. Twas these were scun- was these disgruntled guardians who opened the gates of our city to heretics, I believe. But of course, if their hatred of the Holy See drove them to such deeds, they might well be persuaded to assist in Sir Emmerich's rescue, knowing the truth he would lay bare. Such is my hope, Master Alfino, and I would have you and Pepper reach out to them. Not me and my boy! As a temple land sworn servant of the Holy See, any overtures I make are doomed to fail. 
But as outsiders, the two of you may receive a warmer welcome. Oh, freedom! Oh, you were testing, Chan. I see you. I see you. Chat was being good. <laughs> Very well. We shall seek out the leader of these revolutionaries and make our case. My thanks, Estinian. Will your brothers heed your command if you order them to stand aside? The dragoons have no love for politics, my lady. They will gladly watch and wait while the highborn fight amongst themselves. How very wise. Pepper, we should hurry up to the Forgotten Knight. Tataru may have knowledge of the revolutionaries. Goodbye, my boy! I miss him already. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, wait, what is this? Morning? Yeah, okay. Okay. Hasn't washed the blood off his armor yet? I fucking wouldn't. It looks badass as hell. Are you kidding me? Pepper, Alfino, gods, I've been worried sick. It's good to see you. <laughs> And you, Tataru, how did you manage to escape the chaos in the streets? Uh, Gib Gribblant, Gi Gibralant, Gibribe? Gerbil, and the others barricaded the doors until the heretics left. No one was harmed, thankfully. But what about you two? What came of your journey? Well, let me tell you. <laughs> You're not serious. What was Sir Emmerich thinking? I mean, the way you two talk about him, I wouldn't have believed. Anyway. I've heard rumors of the people you're looking for, but I doubt they'll be of much use. The only thing I can say with any certainty is that they're led by someone called the Mongrel. A queer moniker? Moniker? If, I ever, if ever I have heard of one. But mayhap it will make the individual in question easier to find. Come, let us all make inquiries below. Okie dokie. Oh, they don't mean below, like below below. We're going. So, you know, for a second I was gonna say this NPC looks like Jay's character, but like, <laughs> then I got a little bit closer. Mm. This way? Oh, so it is below, because they said below, so I thought they would be here, but I looked at the map. Um, I guess it's a lot bigger down here than I anticipated, right? Like, down, down? Yeah. Oh, oh, out, out! Oh, is this a shortcut? What? Sexy. Not a, even a shortcut. I would still have to... Anyways. Hey, what's that? Speak up. I can't hear as well as I used to. <laughs> okay, great. Thank you. That was very helpful. What? 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 Where is this other person? <laughs> Hello? What? Are you- are you up here? What? No, you're down here. Are you under here? <sighs> Alright. And I don't know a goddamn thing- a god's damn thing about the mongrel, but if I did, you could be sure I wouldn't tell you. Alright. All right, y'all are very helpful indeed. <laughs> Thank you for the hydration, I appreciate it. The water just splashed on my nose. Love that for me. Mongrel, I'm not sure I catch your meaning. To a blue blood, we're all of us dogs down here. Okay, where is Mr. Alfie now? Perfect. Not a single shred of information? Just as I expected. These revolutionaries would not have evaded capture for so long without the masses' complicity. Still, it is good to know that Tataru's ears are as sharp as ever. Alright, more legs for me. Hmm. 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 Hmm.
frustrating though it may be, we must press on. While I continue speaking with the people of the room, why not go and see if Gerbil knows aught of value? As the proprietor, proprietor, proprietor <laughs> of the Forgotten Knight, surely he must have heard whispers of the Mongol before. You can only hope that he will be more forthcoming than the others. Oh, Sarnax, I want to see. Is it? Do the hand thing! Do the hand thing! Do the sexy hand thing! That's apparently the Dragoon armor from the trailer. You know, the sexy armor? Yeah. That's what Sarnax is wearing. Alrighty, do we go up here? Can I go up here? I think so. I just have to go into the broom. Could have gone anywhere, I guess. Hmm. This will lead me there, though. Yeah, we're good. Okay, and he's the guy down here, right? Yeah. You know, people long for a sympathetic ear, but they need to know that it comes with tight lips. You know what else comes with tight lips? Peppermint. <laughs> she doesn't say anything at all in the entire game. Discretion, Pepper. That's what my customers expect. If they don't get it, then I don't get them. That being said, I'm not without my sympathies. I've heard the tales, and I know you've done right by highborn and lowborn alike. Least I can do is point you in the right direction. But to do that, I'll need you to do something for me. So happens there's a hunter up in the crozier who owes me a fair bit of coin. However, I've agreed to accept payment in fresh herbs. Now go and get them for me. Agreed? God damn it, you're making me do a fucking fetch quest. Speak with the hulking hunter in the pillars? Oh. He's hulking, is he? <laughs> Yeah, this is my first time playing. We met plenty of husbandos, but finally it's time to meet a new waifu. Yeah, I want to meet a new waifu. I want another wife. Give me a wife. Give me a few. The only wife I have right now. Well, I had Moonbrita, but she passed away. Or was murdered. <laughs> is, uh, yeah, so, oh, hello. What are you doing here? Moonbrita and uh, Ishtola. I say, the tales they are telling in the streets. Lady Iceheart, infamous leader of the heretics, a ravishing beauty? Yes, her hair is white as ice. I wonder, what's the color of the hat? I'm sorry. Can you finish that question? Are you... Are you asking what her coochie hair is like? Is he asking... Is he wondering if her coochie hair is as white as snow? If the curtains match the, match the drapes? I'm sorry, what? Nah, Isail is not uh, a waifu for me. Yes, I'm the errand girl. Any road, I hope you appreciate how much trouble I had to go through on account of his bloody herbs. Tell him to enjoy them while they last because I doubt I'll be able to find any more next year. Thank you, Hunter. Appreciate it. Yeah, I miss Moonbrita. She was a really, really good character. Hmm? Hmm. Beep, bop, boop, bada, beep, bop, boop, bada, boop, beep, bada, ba, doop, bada, ba, da, ba, 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 da, ba, 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 Good night, Atka. Take care. Thank you for hanging out with us. I appreciate it. Hope you have a good night. My bad. That was the wrong door. What time is it? Wait. That's the Eorzean time. Local time. Oh, yeah. Local time. 12.30 a.m. God damn. I've been playing this game all day. Well, you gonna hand them over or not? Yeah, I got you. I got you. I this ought to do it. With a few other spices, I can make it just like she used to. There are a few things which stir the hearts of men like a sip of mulled wine. Share a glass with the right people, and who knows what stories they'll share. Mm, I see you. This armor is pretty cute. I can't deny it, babes. I really can't. 
But is it worth taking? Is it worth taking? No. I could just buy it. Should I get the silver pieces? Should I get the silver pieces or should I get the armor? Silver pieces or armor, chat? I can't wear any of them. <laughs> I may be able to wear the titanium cuirass, cur cuirass offending at some point. Actually, let me see what the die is like. Oh, fuck. Wait a minute. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> you sell them? Armor's worth more if you sell on market board? Oh. Fun hacks. Yo. Okay, I'll just take it. And if I sell it, I sell it. Oh, she's made seven to some noble houses or another, I forgot. Anyway, it'd be a shame if she didn't get this get to try this wine. Okay, so I'm gonna go give this wine to a lady and she's going to tell me things. That is what I'm gathering from this quest. All the way up there. Okay. See fetchy quests. Fetchy quests like these, I don't mind because at least like I'm fetching like information as I go and it's just not like filler garbage, you know? It feels like this is actually part of the plot. And I like that. God, Ishgard is so fucking beautiful. I love it so much. It reminds me of um Solitude. <laughs> A little bit. Yes, I'm Hiritha. Is that how you pronounce it? Hiritha? Hiri Meh. Beg your pardon, but do I know you, miss? No, but I got one for you, babes. I I know the smell. This is the wine that girl used to prepare. Her special recipe. It must be decades since I last tasted this. Oh, the poor dear. Such a shame she was taken in by that baron. He cut a dashing figure, I'll grant you that. Tall, slender, long of ear. <sighs> but those dazzling ruby eyes of his were filled with lust. It was not more than infatuation, what she felt, but she confessed herself it was love, and he couldn't help but take advantage. Aha! A narcissist. And when her belly started to grow, <gasps> God, is a scandal. I mean, it is not an uncommon occurrence, but that it was with a hero made it so much. Oh wait, the hero are the humans, right? Well, I need to tell you, she was discharged from his service, cast out on the streets like so much refuse. After she returned to the broom, we drifted apart. I only learned of her death years later by chance. So Emmerich's mother is dead? Gasp. His mother is dead and was fucked by the Pope. Wait, are is she even talking about th that's what we're talking about right that, that, that's what we're talking about right i'm sorry my fc got an ishgard house i want to get one so bad but the area is not open for me yet and i'm really sad about it <laughs> i'll get one eventually at least i'll try to get one eventually Fuck. So the, uh, so the amorous nobleman bed nobleman beds his maidservant, then casts her aside when the seed takes root. Not the most original tale, is it? Gold comfort for the woman and children who live it, though. Even the penitent, penitent? Can appreciate wine from time to time. Take Geraldia, for example. Surely you've heard of him. No, absolutely the fuck not. He's a monk who, who offers succor to the poorest of the poor in the broom. A man of many vows, but none which prohibit spiritu spiritus, spirituous, spirituous, spirit, 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 beverages. Aye, if ever there was a man who deserved a drink, it'd be him. Do you want me to go give him a drink? Yeah. Oh, he's down below. That's easy. At least I think he's down below. Yeah, he's in the broom. Oh, fudge, it's this way. Is he the old man that couldn't hear? Oh, he's over here. Uh -huh. What up, Jair Bear? Halone's blessings be upon you, miss. I. A gift? For me? Did 
The scent, how reminiscent of a wine once made by a dear old friend. May her soul rest in peace. Forsaken by her family, she toiled tirelessly to feed and clothe her child. Yet somehow she found time to help me tend to those in even worse circumstances. So compassionate she was, so full of love for her fellow man. It was that love which gave her child strength, which gave her child strength to endure the scorn of the other younglings. <sighs> that girl, bless her heart, she couldn't help what she was. Eventually, she won them over, but those first years, first few years were trying, even more so when she had to start fending for herself. I remember days she spent standing on the walls, raven black hair flowing in the wind, staring out as if searching for her mother's face in the mists. Well, goddamn. This is getting sad. My cat ears are cute. Thank you, bit banando, banat, banat, banadano, banadano, banabanabo, banabado. <laughs> Thank you. I think that's the better shortcut, right? Is it? No, it's not. It's that one. Yeah, Pope is humping and murdering citizens. I think that's what's happening here. Yes, Alfie, no, hey. I doubt they'd be so careless as to be caught out by the Temple Knights. Nevertheless, it is only prudent that we ask. I wonder if I can find any more NPCs hanging around. Do you think my boy is still in the manor? Banana, Fofana, Bobana, Bonana. She was a remarkable woman, Pepper. After everything she was forced to endure, she still remained hopeful for the future. For her daughter's future? Daughter? Some bonds are thicker than blood, but blood still defines us and divides us in the end. It's the legacy of our parents, Pepper, and we can't escape it, no matter how hard we try. I don't even know my parents. So the mongrel and her pups chose to embrace theirs. Oh yes, the mongrel, that's what we're looking for. To proclaim it all in sundry. If you can understand that, then maybe you can find her on your own. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, speak with the broom starveling. Was that her? Oh, I just realized I went the wrong way. <laughs> That's fine. Yes, this is my first playthrough. I've never played this game before. I'm very new to this. Still looking for your mongrel? Like I said before, take your pick. Plenty around, if you know where to look. Or did you fancy someone specific? I'm looking for a mongrel with ruby red eyes and raven black hair. Doesn't matter which- Ugh, whatever. Doesn't ring a bell, sorry. Shut up, you know who I'm talking about. Oh, someone's got unusual taste. Afraid I can help you though. Won't, rather. It's bloody obvious you ain't of the broom. Did you think I'd just tell you because you asked nicely? Oh. She did not like that. So you get Alfie now? Okay. Feel second playthroughs? Why would you push yourself like that? Yeah, it couldn't be me, I say, as I definitely would do that. I would 100% play this game again. I don't know why I would, but I would. If only to play with my, with my pals, I would at least level a class from 1 to 90. Oh wow, thank you for giving me a little boost. Are you sure you're not probably reasonable likes? I said. Oh, wait. Where's Alfie? Is he in here? Yeah. Have you made any progress, Pepper? Hmm. So our monk was born of an Elizan nobleman and a Huron maidservant. Ah. Granted, it is no location, but it is far more information than we had before. Yes. Now that we are striking, her, now that her striking features are known to us, then how we need only remain vigilant. Let's go, baby. Fire and blood. Thank you, thank you. There must be a way we can draw the mongrel out into the open. Hmm. 
may happen we should discuss this with Tataru? Speaking of which, where's Taru? She... Oh, confound it. She went below to make inquiries on her own, didn't she? We must find her quickly, Pepper. I have a pre premonition that this is not going to go well. Da -da -da. Oh, so the shortcut to the broom is through here. Yes. Okay, cool, cool, cool. You know the quest text? What a legend. I do. Well, I am a streamer. <laughs> You cast your gaze over the streets below, but see no sign of Tataru. Damn it, Tataru! This game has the best sound design. It really does. It really, really does. I think I found her, babes. She must be around here somewhere. I take it you've no luck either? There she is. Ah! I'm sorry, forget I said anything. Oh, girl. Wait, down there, isn't that Tataru? <gasps> Those men are chasing her. Quickly, Pepper, after them. Bitch, what about you? Oh, we're coming. you're coming with me. Okay, I thought you just meant I go and do the dirty work and you watch from afar. Oh, sweet baby. Where do you think you're going, Missy? Oh God, voice acting. I, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend. What's going on here? What's it to you, boy? Piss off. Hold on. I've seen them around. They're in and out of House Four Tom's Manor all the time. Oh, I see. Skulking about at your highborn master's bidding, eh? Bloodhounds hoping to catch a whiff of heresy, is that it? You are quite mistaken, I assure you. We came here to help. And if you know what's good for you, you will let us pass. Ha mm. <laughs> ha! Listen to the pups yapping. Come here, boy. I'll give you cause to yelp. See, normally that would turn me on, but Tataru is crying, so I'm good. Enough! Leave threatening women and children to our betters. We don't have the knack. Mommy? Killed her! Now! Lay a finger on the blue blood's pups, and you're like to lose the hand. Be still, my aching gay heart. The second I saw that ponytail, on God. Oh, hello, Hilda. Hello. Lay okay. Uh, uh -huh. In often I get called on by glorious heroes like yourself. So tell me, what have I done to deserve you? I am barking internally. I am barking. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I didn't mean to speak to you. Before you start, let's go somewhere a bit more private, eh? The Forgotten Knights, say. Eh? Okay. Bye, Hilda. I love you so much. I will make you so happy. Um, I want to talk to Tataru real quick if she doesn't disappear. <laughs> so this is love. Mm -hmm. So this is love. <laughs> I think I may love her and she wants to speak to me in private. 
This ain't private. There are people here. I'm, I'm sorry. Commence battle? Or while in a party? I y'all. It was nice knowing you. Goodbye. I must disband. Fare thee well. Belshiza. Holy shit. She is fucking fine. Chalky milk share? No. Mine. Mine. This cat girl needs her fuel. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, while you're on your way to kill Nidhogg, you stumbled on some dirty secrets that the Holy See has been hiding for centuries. Eh? What are they on about? The High Houses. And what makes a nobleman so bleeding noble? They trace their blood back to King Thorden and his Knights Twelve, the founders of Ishgard. But our friends here reckon we're all descended from the heroes of Eld. Highborn and lowborn alike. And so Sir Emmerich, Lord Commander of the Temple Knights, has gone to ask the Archbishop if he wouldn't mind letting everyone know. Is he simple? The old bastard will have him executed for heresy. Well, seems to me that's what the good sir wants. Seems he thinks a noble sacrifice will serve to prove his claims. Oh my god. Oh my god. We cannot stand idly by and allow Sir Emmerich to do this. Ishgard has need of him. Look, you've a good heart, I can see that. Willing to risk your neck for someone else even when his troubles ain't yours. But what's this got to do with me? If Sir Emmerich is imprisoned in the vault, we will need all the help we can muster to breach their defences and rescue him. The floating weapon. What in the hells? Ah, the unmistakable scent of heresy. Girl, you gotta put on some lip balm. I'm sorry. This is not the look. You look like you just gave the Archbishop your fucking Gok Gok 3000 double, like, twisty and suck and suck behind his throne and then walked out without even like drying your lips washing it off a little bit this is not it this is not it no no and what do we have here the honored guests of house for tom consorting with the queen of rats Plotting insurrection, I shouldn't wonder. That won't do. Ew, I hate this person. Sickness is wont to fester and spread. It must be burnt out ere the infection takes hold. I reckon Sir would be happy to wield the irons himself. Well, so happens. I've got irons of my own.
Such simple creatures, rats. Certain to attack when cornered. Let us step outside, milady. In here, your toys could hurt someone. Oh, I'm gonna rip those fucking hair clips off your hair, buddy. Mm-mm. 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 Let me, let, let, thank you. Wait, no, my carbuncle is here. Okay, yeah, it's loading up. Right there! There's more babes, there's more, there's so many! Mm. You, disgust me. you disgust me, bitch! Okay, so are you the healer? Fuck, stay focused on this guy, please, game. Okay, yeah, it's these guys, okay. Okay. I definitely have to make sure that my party doesn't die. But, you know. I currently have other priorities. And it actually does not look like it's going all over there, though. Hello, game? He's so tanky. He's got so much. <gasps> My boy! My boy! My sweet boy! My boy! He come to help! He come to assist! My sweet boy! Right into my fucking coochie, please and thank you. Oh my god, there's so many of them now. No me. denying your gifts. A well-deserved reputation indeed. I love that they ca they like have him come Enough. to fight with us. It just that makes me so happy. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, what? Sorry, what? He said, see you, bitch. Ah, lucky spider man out of there. Good God. Nay, tis we who are lucky. Had we fought on, t'was but a matter of time before our conflict claimed the life of an innocent bystander.
I thought the Heaven's Ward might come here as well. They came to the Temple Knight's headquarters. Aye. Sir Gruno announced that the Lord Commander had been imprisoned under suspicion of heresy, and that the Heaven's Ward had been granted full authority in his stead. Then the Heaven's Ward now commands the Temple Knights. Those still loyal to Sir Emmerich answer to me. Alas, that amounts to but half her number. The other half, who opposed his promotion to Lord Commander, have gathered at the vault as ordered. Bolster in the guard already, eh? If I didn't know any better, I'd say you were expected. I take it you're in charge around here? Hilda, and yes. The young master was just persuading me to join his lost cause. Convincing little beggar, isn't he? I love her so much. <laughs> I, your passion moved me. A bit. That, and the fact that we're sick of living off the leavings of our betters. If you've a mind to change things around here, then we've a mind to join you. Getting so intense. It's getting so intense, babes. It is one o'clock. Do I keep going, chat? Do I keep going? Yes. Go. I I want to keep going, but I want to make sure y'all are comfortable with me continuing onward, continuing heavens onward. See what I see what I did there. See that? Do you like that joke? <laughs> all right, all right, all right, chat. Okay, all right, all right. We'll keep going. We'll keep going. Naked lady. Okay. <laughs> I just gotta. I, I just gotta stretch my legs. Give me a second. All right. I'll be right back. Give me like literally two minutes. I'm just, I'm literally just, and you know what, fuck it, I'll just do main camera. I'm just stretching my legs. Oh. I wish I could play the game like this. Oh my god. Hi, Akil! Yes, I am still streaming. Degenerate hours, baby. <laughs> Mr. Moo, my Mr. Moo. That's nothing to play, I know, right? Don't you play on controller? Yes, but my chair is not comfortable. As you can see, I can't lean back. You're sure as fuck, aren't you? Yeah. Don't got to remind me. Feels better. Imagine if you tooted, honestly. <laughs> big stretch. Good kitty gotta do a big stretch. Alright, chat. You ready? We're going back in. Here we go. Let me guess. You're wondering why I chose the mongrel, right? Because it's what I am, and I'm not ashamed of it. Not anymore. Besides, even my pureblood pups have more in common with me than the lords and ladies up on high. They none of them are well-bred. They none of them are well-bred. Okay. Hell, some of their mothers were cast out after a spot of fun. Same as mine. Story old as time, and one we're sick of hearing, which is why we took up arms. 
Not that we mean to hold all the blue bloods to account. Some have done right by us. I'll allow. Like them in house. Hel Helenarte? Helenar? Nanar? Nanar? But enough talk. Your friend's still rotten in a cell. Let's not keep him waiting. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go get Samaric! The pluckish rogue? Yes. Yes. I am so... My boy! I saw him in there! I saw my boy! We've been working in secret to undermine the Holy See and the High Houses. That much I'll acknowledge. But this nonsense about us... Bleh. But this nonsense... Can I do the next duty with you? Sure! Do you want to wear your Dragoon armor? <laughs> uh, but this nonsense about us throwing, throwing wide the gates to the heretics is just that. Nonsense. If not you, then who? You Temple Knights, of course! Reckoned it was your beloved Sir Emmerich's doing at first, but then I heard how he lost his head. My next best guess would be the Heaven's Ward. That way, they'd, fit, they'd have the perfect excuse to go door to door through the broom, slaughter the heretics and their sympathizers in one fell swoop. But the Heaven's Ward scheme did not account for Lady Iceheart's intervention, and so they have been forced to improvise. A fine bloody mess, ain't it? But the die is cast. So what's the plan? We must divert the attention of the High Houses away from the city, and to do that, we need the cooperation of your allies in their service. And what makes you think I have friends in high places? You would be fools not to, given your goals. Lowborn knights are an ideal recruits. You must swore fealty only out of desire for a better life. Fealty. If offered an opportunity to shed the yoke and live for themselves, who among them would not at least be tempted to take it? Rare is the man eager to die for a cause he does not hold dear. But it need not come to that this day. If they are their fellow knights are deployed, if they are, if they and their fellow knights are deployed a field to deal with a new threat, a massing of heretics, for example, then they will be able, then they will be unable to join in the defense of the vault. Huh? Spread false rumors of an attack to get him out of harm's way. You mean? The city will not soon forget the forget the heretics' last assault. If the high houses believe an attack is imminent, they will have no choice but to act. Can it be done? Can we trick them into leaving Ishgard? Aye. Can we keep them out for long? Not bloody likely. Make sure you're ready before I send word, because you won't get a second chance at this. Then it is decided. To the vault! The Archbishop must be held to account. Held accountable. I don't fucking skip it too fast. And the Lord Commander granted his liberty. Ooh. Okay, so... Who's in my... Who who am I who am I inviting? Who's coming into my party? Cause I know I have Vincent, um, but I guess I'm doing. We're bringing in Sarnix and we're bringing in Jay. If he's a, I cannot locate the character. Okay, come hither. And I'm guessing um, uh, Kelsey, right? Uh, how many people? Is this a is this a light party? Is it a full party? What is it? Light party? Okay. Oh. Oh uh, wait, too many DPS. Oh no. I mean, I. I mean, I can tank. <laughs> I don't want to. So sorry, can DPS. I think it's gonna be me and Jay on DPS, and I think- or no, Sarnix wants a DPS. Wait, I'm DPSing. Wait, we can't all DPS. You love tanking? Okay, Jay's tanking! Okay, can I come with you, Syra? Ah! Okay, well then, I'll have to- it'll be me, Jay, Sarnix, and I'll drop out, uh, I guess someone? Maybe Kelsey? I don't know. David, you wanna- you wanna do it? Sure, we'll rotate. We'll rotate. Okay. So, Davey, do I have you added? I do, right? I don't remember what your character's name is. It's Weston, right? Weston Alessandro? Okay, so Davey's healing. I'm DPS. Jay is tanking. Sarnix is DPS. Okay. Okay. So, Kelsey. We are going to nix you so we can bring in my friend Davey. I've actually never played with you before, Davey. I've play I've taken pictures with you, but I haven't played with you. So that'll be fun. Okay. 
So now I just wait. We wait. Ooh. Who this? Who that? <gasps> wait, no, no. No, not yet. No, not yet. No. 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 I want to talk to my boy. 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 I want to say something to my boy. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's not the end of the world. It's okay. I, I gotta re I gotta restart the quest. I gotta restart the game now. <sighs> Go to the events tab. I why? I wanna talk to Orshifon. I wanted to speak to him. Oh yeah, I'll see him again. I'll just I'll just wave to him in the battlefield. Hello babes! <laughs> All right, Jay, where the fuck are you? Wait, is this, who is this? Who is, hello. I wave. I do, I do a wave. I can't abandon main story quests. You can't do that. It's a main quest. See? Fuck, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I wanted to say something to him. What does he say? Can someone go find the dialogue option? I want to know what he says. He'll remember this one time we didn't talk to him about. No! Stop it! My heart is hurting. I mean, normally I usually never actually speak to the NPCs at all, so I should not be mad. <sighs> hello, Dynasty. Hello, hello. And hi, Aunt Antony Doom. What's up? He says I love you, Syrah. Um, no. He says I love you, Pepper. God, get it right. Come on. <laughs> All right, so what are we doing? Who am I waiting for? You can force close the game and it'll reset you to start the conversation. Oh, shit, there you are. You know what? I really wish I knew that. I'm so fucking sad. I'm so sad! I, and I don't want to look it up. I don't want to look it up because I don't want to get spoilers. It's fine, though. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. What happened? I didn't get to talk to Orshifon. <laughs> I can't restart the quest. I cannot. That's not how that works. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's not how that works. I can't just do that. I wish I knew what he would have said to me. Probably nothing. I'm probably just, we will win, Pepper. I am fighting by your side! <laughs> Probably some corny shit! <laughs> About you readying for the fight to come? Yeah. Or he presses love to you, gets on there. Fuck you, Jay! Ah! You know what? I did skip a Realm Reborn in my other file. So I could just replay Heaven's War just to get to that scene. <laughs> Yeah, I'm yeah, I'm sure it's literally just him being like, oh yeah, good luck, be safe, make right choices, take care, see you later. <laughs> <sighs> I'm so antsy now. <laughs> he says with allies of Jesus, we cannot fail unless it was in a cutscene. Mm -hmm. With allies such as these? Okay, thanks everybody. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, now I know. Okay, hey, now I know. <laughs> Thank you. Hi, Captain Ordo. What if it's some steamy, corny shit? God, I fucking wish. Oh, we're waiting on our friend Davy.
Do you like the new title of my stream? Who's Davy in chat? Literally Davy. <laughs> um, yeah, they're doing the data center travel right now and apparently it's taking a second. No biggie though. That's okay. We can wait a little bit. I've never gotten to play with Davy, so I'm actually really excited to have them in the party. Have them heal my ass. Coming in from Q now. Yay! Hurrah! Last time I caught a stream, you had just browser ARR. How are you liking the game so far? It is really, really, really good. Go continue the quest. Oh. But I want to wait for Davy, and then we can all run together. I want to... It's not the same. <laughs> then we all go. <laughs> Immersion. Exactly. I'm into it now, Jay. I understand how annoying you are, because now I'm that person. <laughs> Then you have to RP walk. No, 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 no. We are hustling. We are hauling ass. I'm getting head pads. Thank you. Oh, wait. Yeah, you wanted me to look at your paladin armor. Oh, I like it. Looks good. You got fucking meaty thighs, boy. <gasps> That's the same shield that Orshifont wields. Cute. Cute. Oh. <coughs> Alright. Davy's here. Not... Present he presently here, but they are here. All right, are we all gonna are we all gonna haul ass? Oh, where do I have to go? Oh god, I have to go all the way over there. Do we TP or do we run? <laughs> run? Fuck yes, aren't it? <laughs> Boom, 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 boom. Did you just call me Peps? Did, I'm sorry, did you just call me Peps? Did you just give me a new nickname and it's Peps? Jay, I don't know how I feel about that. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> oh, I don't like that pose. Pepsi woman. Peps. I'm getting head pets again? Wow, well, okay. I guess maybe I do like that nickname then. <laughs> Davy! Where are you? You're supposed to come and dramatically walk with us! <laughs> Call me Pepsi Cola. Cock Coco. Peppis? <laughs> Not Peppis. Not Peppis. <laughs> Did Davy die? You know what, Davy? You you'll meet us there. All right. Here we go. We're going. We're going. We're going. We're going. I think it's this way, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sarnox, why are you so fucking fast? Wait, it's up this way, right? Yeah. Yeah. Alright. This is D. Well. <laughs> we go! <laughs> Could you imagine if it was just like everybody in chat and me just kamikazeing? <laughs> Can we all just like have an army of Lalafells, please? Oh, oh my god. So my canon nickname that I gave Orshifon, if I ever actually write fanfiction of us, of us, of him and Pep, is uh, she calls him Coco. Oh, hello, Vosk, of course. Vosk, head of the game, waiting, as always, for my arrival. <laughs> Shut up, Jay! The other third position, Mistress Pepper. <sighs> I will send word once you and your party have entered. All right. Here we go, babes. Here we go. Okay. Is it? It's the vault, right? Yeah, yeah. We heard us not taking it back. Go away. Go away. <laughs> 
I won't stoop to that level. I saw Link from Legend of Zelda. Okay, the color coordination? Did you see that shit? <laughs> Chef's kiss. Oh, is it a mo only time? Here, I can do it if Sarnex is not here. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna have a crumpet. Oh my fucking- I, I always do that! I always pull out my carbuncle while it's already there because it's like lagging behind and I don't see it. Do you go this way? Okay. <laughs> That's so weird. This is so intense because y'all are in emote only mode. Like, I feel like I should be worried. <laughs> What's gonna happen to me? Am I gonna get shish kebobbed? <laughs> like, what's going on? Actually, don't tell me. Don't say anything in chat. <laughs> I mean, you can't say anything. You're in a mo only mode, so. Pepper just glided. See that? Game. I hate it when it fucking does that. Vibes with the music, I agree, Jay. I absolutely agree. It's the um, the organ. Yeah, the atmosphere is so good. I love this shit so much. It's why I love Ishgard. Anything that's like pseudo cathedral gothic, I'm sold. Like, say less, I'm in. Oh fuck, what the hell? Hey. Huh? Blind me, why don't you? Don't know where I should be standing. <laughs> Ow! Okay, those really hurt. Okay. And I lost my charge. That's my fault. That's my fault. I was not paying attention to where I was supposed to stand. Oh, is he not done? Oh, he is done. Okay. I... I'll fucking take it. I don't care. Whatever. I'm coming! Wait, I'm coming, guys! Wait for me! Sorry. 
sigils on the ring. Oh, don't don't tell me things like that, Jay. I'm never gonna take it off then. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Game? I hate it when it does that. It's all good though. It's all good though. Sometimes when I tunnel vision this game, it gets like f super frustrating, but we vibe, we vibe, we vibe, we vibe. You know what? I'm just gonna take them all. Oh, hello. is all irritated. <gasps> Ooh! Oh, bitch. This is so nice. This is so nice. Charles? Charles. I can't believe I called you Charles. Okay, Jay. Big pull. Big pull. Huge pull. It's my chat. White Knights. I'll cut you to pieces. No, you absolutely will not. They just got so big. Anything I can do with these fucking throbbing void holes? I guess apart from like staying away from them. Oh no, it's because of the loot. Wait, did I ever- did I finish? Yeah, I did, okay. Okay. Bye bye. Okay, let me drink a little bit. 
Uh, guys, give me one second. I'm gonna just take an Advil. Actually, I have no idea if they're in, um, if they're, if they're still watching my stream. But... Okay. Thank you, uh, you, you, you have for the, uh, prime sub. I appreciate it. And Ash Rules, I think I missed that as well. Ash Rules, thank you for the prime sub as well. Okay, good. All good. All good. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready. You go this way? Okay. So Davey in chat said, I'm like Sarah, I play in control as well. The flow of movement is easier. It is. It feels way nicer. I love playing on controller. It definitely does have some cons, I will admit. But for the most part, it's really nice. There's the enemy locking issue that I've been experiencing and I'm sure I can like figure that out on my own, like figure out a uh, quick fix. It's never bothered me a lot. It's just like there's obviously like a couple seconds of game time that like go down the drain and by a couple seconds I literally mean one or two. Mostly just one second. I'm not gonna get hit by that, right? Yeah, I was around the edge of it. Okay, we got one more. Sir Sharber. Sharber? 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 Ooh, popcorn! Ooh, we're popcatting and popcorny. Oh yeah, Davy, you experienced the lock issue too. Yeah, it's it's really frustrating. I figured it out a little bit um, playing as a healer, but ugh, it's a nightmare with the enemies. to remove that issue? There might be, Jay. I'm not sure. I'll tinker around with it later. Cathedral Gargoyle? Oh, fuck me up, dude. Hey, we'll talk to Yoshi P. Thank you, Jay. Almost used one at the end of that fight. Oh, cutscene? It's Cocklips. Oh, he big. I like your helm, though. It's kind of nice. <laughs> with the flashbangs. Should dodge chest pieces nice. They'll debuff you if they run into you. Okay, sounds good. The 
holy chain? What is this? What does that mean? What does that mean? Oh, this is like that one dungeon. Oh, I remember doing this shit. Where the zombies or the mummies or whatever come out. I just realized I wasn't doing anything there. Oh, hello. Thank you. Thank you. And now the final cup. Oh, these! Holy flames! Destroy these. Okay, cool. Oh, no, 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 no. This should be a mercy. Let me LB? Is he lo- ah! <laughs> Wait! Ah! Fuck! Jay, you fucking distracted me, you bitch! <laughs> ah! So, should I do it now? I always let my team be in charge of that. Not yet? Yeah, he still has a little bit of juice in him. I'm pushing it. I pushed it. Okay. We do a sweat. We do a sweat. We do a Moogle sweat. She do. <laughs> Someone killed the boss where he could use it. I figured. Maybe was it was it Sarnix? Was it me? I don't know. Probably Sarnix. Sarnix does chunk. Yeah, Sarnix does big damage. <laughs> yeah. That's what I thought. I was like, could not have been me. <laughs> All right, we done. We did it. We did it, team. We did it. We saved the day. All right. We did it. I'm assuming a big cutscene's gonna come through. Yeah, there we go. <sighs> oh, power! How can this be? <laughs> cutscene, yum, 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 yum. Fall back! <laughs> run, Pep, run! <gasps> is that. Is that Sid? <laughs> is, is that Sid? <laughs> I'm living for the popcorn spam. I thought that said titties, but it says yes. <laughs> oh shit. Wait. That's not Sid. Wait. What's going on here? Oh, we got him. Father, please! We were not too late, my friends. <gasps> so PMA, he's like a puppy, I love him. Why must you do this, father? Sorry, I should not be smiling. This is an int intense moment. Nidhogg is fallen. There is no need for further deception. Now is the time to renounce the lies which led us down this path. To start anew. And tear down the very pillars of our society? Our history? Our values? Everything we have built over a thousand years? <sighs> a fool to the last. Look out! 
out! My knight in shining armor? No. Absolutely not! This is law awaits. My boy! My boy! Lord Oshafon! My boy! <laughs> the one character I sent for and they take it the Forgive me. I could not bear the thought of. No! You can't be so sweet! You're dying! Oh. oh no! Don't no, be so PMA! I so. can't help it! Why would you do that? A smile better suits. <laughs> bits I appreciate it uh, well I've made it to my would-be in-laws home Don't. 
please. <laughs> a knight lives to serve, to protect, to sacrifice. There is no greater calling. Leave me to mourn and give chase for my son and for the nation he loved. Go. Okay. I go. Can I get one of those coats now? I can really use a coat right now. His that would be nice. His shall not be forgotten. I would like Ugh. a coat, please. kind of turned around and let it happen. Sorry. <laughs> I wasn't really a good uh, partner there. <laughs> um, okay. <sighs> stop it! No, stop! Stop being so Oh. oh, my eyes are burning. <laughs> my eyes are burning. I need to wipe my face. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Oh, oh my eyes are fucking burning. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh. Okay. Thank you for all the hugs, friends. Pepper is, is, um, not okay. I appreciate everybody giving me hugs while I saw up. Um. <laughs> Cosplaying a legendary Toronto raccoon, you're right. <laughs> yeah, maybe waterproof mascara would have been really fucking nice. I mean, the game can't get any worse, right? Like, it can't get any worse than this, right? Now might be a good time to go to sleep. No, I have to avenge him. I have to avenge him. I can't go now. I need to. Per I need to keep going. Oh, please be voice acted. I can't. I can't do it. I need to hear your sorrow. That actually might My be friend, worse. Okay. I am in your debt. Think nothing of it. Your wounds are healing well, I trust. How does Elfie Some wounds sound so do cavalier? not heal. <laughs> am I gonna get a little crystal? Oh my god, it's so bright. I could get a little crystal now, right? No, it's a fucking echo! God damn it. Oh yeah, because I grabbed my head, not my the booty. Founding. The scriptures, a thousand years of lies, all to deceive the common man. Nay, our own brothers and sisters. For the blood of the Knights Twelve flows within all our veins. You knew this to be true. You knew, and you concealed it. Tell him, bitch. I should be interested to hear how you came by this knowledge. But yes, you have the right of it. I just noticed how fucking furry his eyebrows are. The <clears throat> architects of Ishgard, King Thorden and his knights twelve, entrapped and butchered the great worm, Ratatoske. That's how you That they might it. partake Ratatoske. of her eyes okay. and thereby transcend their mortal limits. Upon learning of their treachery, Nidhogg was consumed with a murderous and justified rage. I dare say you know what followed. The Great Worm slew the king and half of his knights. Aye, but Nidhogg was subdued. 
and his eyes plucked from their sockets by the knights that remained. Their one mistake was to show mercy, for from his brother Hreisvelger did Nidhogg receive a new eye, thus rejuvenating his form and empowering him to embark upon an eternal quest for vengeance. Yeah, well, I know that. Yeah, no, I'm on that quest well, for what y'all did to my boy. One of Nidhogg's boy. eyes and learned to wield its power in defense of his people. Thus was the first Life Azure Dragoon art. born, and ever since that time, his honored successors have risen to drive Nidhogg from our lands whenever the worm has returned to plague us. <sighs> Is this still for your channel in the directory? A chef's kiss? Oh god. <laughs> Please post I a screen you, cap my in my server. <laughs> Will you answer for my sins? Will your son and his son answer for me as well? What do you mean? If a man cannot atone for his sins in the course of his all too fleeting life, must his progeny then be held to account? Must every subsequent generation be judged as well? Thorin's betrayal of Ratatoska was an unconscionable, unforgivable sin. Should we then, as his descendants, meekly surrender ourselves to an eternity of punishment? Nay, say I, I would not see our children sacrificed in a vain attempt to appease an implacable foe. Dragons are not like us, my son. To they who live forever, the wrongs of antiquity are as those of yesterday. No reparations You know what I love about the suffice. echo? It's like filler episodes. <laughs> this fact alone should serve as ample justification for our actions. Yet some refuse to see it as such. For men like you, who yearn to commit themselves to a nobler cause, a more compelling narrative is required. This is your solution. This is how you protect our people. Emmerich's voice actor is pretty good, I can't lie. You have given us a lost cause, a death sentence, with your compelling narrative. You but doom our countrymen to give their lives for a lie. And they do so gladly. Highborn and lowborn alike are proud to serve, to fight and die for their country. Is the audio out of sync? It's not, right? You're just messing with me? Don't do that. I've already said it before. Please don't do that unless it's like actually out of sync. And what would you say to them? What would you tell the wives who have lost their husbands? The mothers who have lost their sons? That their loved ones died for naught. I, uh... Over the course of a thousand years, countless men have donned these robes. Like how he's just getting told And every right one now. of them came to accept the necessity of this solution. Once, I hoped you might come to accept like my it little as well. boy. Who do you think you are? What happened to his arm? Did his dad hurt him? Do not despair, my son. Soon I shall free us from the sins of antiquity and bring about the change you so fervently desire. Hmm. So I can escort him out. If he has spoken with others, I would have their names. Escort him to a cell and question Interrogation, him. that's it. Thoroughly. Your eminence. I will end you. You and Cocklips. I swear to God. I am not letting that little blonde haired twink get away with this. <laughs>
You saw something, did you not? A vision of the past. So this is the power of the Echo. Would that it had shown you a finer moment from my past. It was an exercise in futility, as you saw. Faced with the firmity of his conviction and his many ready rejoinders, my words deserted me. To be frank, I am embarrassed to recall it. A friend once impressed upon me the importance of differentiating between words, deeds, and beliefs. Were he here, I suspect he would judge your father's conviction to be no more than rank, self-serving delusion. Even so, I cannot help but wonder what manner of change he intends to bring about. I have given some I thought to that as well. I love the Ellis and the ear uh, earpieces so much. During the battle within the vault, the Heaven's Ward demonstrated strange and unnatural abilities. Aye, the manner in which Sir Zephyrin struck down Lord Horshafon was unlike anything I've ever seen before. <laughs> Don't the give me a recap. The called to mind King Thornton and his Knights Twelve as they are depicted in scripture. Holy powers and all. Mere fabrications, which have become objects of faith, instilled with the belief of countless devoted souls. Seven hells! If Lady Iceheart can use her own body as a vessel for summoning, I see no reason why others could not. Are the Heaven's Ward truly so reckless? I know it was Zephyrin, but I'm also going to fight Cocklips just because of the way he looks. <laughs> Cause, have you seen his Cocklips? <laughs> he is part of it! Unbelievable. He's the one who bothered me and Hilda. <laughs> he interrupted us. As they fled, my father spoke of Aziz La. Though I know not what he intends, I fear no good shall come of it. His ambitions are too great, and his minions too powerful. We must find the Heaven's Ward and stop my father before it is too late. Well, Mistress Mint, Master Alfino, I, Emmerich, Lord of Lord Commander of the Temple Knights of Ishgard, do hereby entreat the aid of the Scions of the Seventh Dawn. Our aid is preventing whatever it is that the Archbishop intends. Your aid is bringing him to justice. Too much blood has been spilled for the lies he perpetuated. No more. I shall pursue him to the end of the world if I must. Life for death, I will have Sir Zephyr's heart for wedding. <laughs> has changed since our order's founding, but our duty to combat the primal threat is not. The Archbishop and the Heavens Order are guilty of the crime of summoning the Pepper and I will stop them. I would that I could join you in the pursuit, but alas, my father's absence has thrown our government into chaos. Even since founding the founding of our nation, there has been an Archbishop to serve as a guiding light for the masses, a force of stability to counterbalance the High House's ceaseless maneuvering. Convincing the people to recognize the truth of her origins would have been difficult even with my father's support. The road ahead is that much more fraught with peril without it. Yet walk it we must, for unity is, for, is more vital to our survival than ever. After all, Nidhogg's death did not mark the cessation of Gervanian hostilities. Far from it. We will have great need of each other in the days to come. I do need a hug. I do need a hug. You may ever count on my lance, Sir Emmerich. To my dying breath, I shall defend Ishgard from the Horde. 
If I may, Lord Commander, I would like to assist the Scions in their search for the Archbishop. B Bishop. Pepper, Master Alfino, pray attend me outside. Very well. With me, Pepper. I believe we have much to discuss. Oh my god, that means he's not in the game anymore. That means I can't go sit on his lap in Camp Dragonhead. Who the... Really glad I could be greeted to this... 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 Hey, are you crying? You okay? Uh, my boyfriend just died. My in-game boyfriend just died. Um. Well. <laughs> what time is it? It's 2 a.m. What do I do? I kind of want to keep going, but I feel like I shouldn't. Banoodles! Banoodles indeed! I know this feels up in there when playing this too. It can't get any worse. There's no way that this can get worse. So you know what? We vibe. The Soleil was eastward bound, so I went. I sent word to, Cl to Camp Cloudtop on the off chance the airship passed nearby. Sure enough, Lady Laniette informed me that it had been sighted by her scouts. And the Archbishop is somewhere in the Sea of Clouds? Or was, not long ago. The airship has not been since has not been seen since it disappeared into the northern reaches near the blue window. Alas, because the region is firmly held by the Vanu Vanu and not easily accessible from Camp Cloudtop, how is Hel I don't know how to pronounce that, has yet to establish a foothold. We will need not only an airship, but a captain bold enough to risk the beastman's wrath. I think we both know the perfect candidate, Pepper. Let us pay a visit to Master Garland at the Sky Steel Manufactory. I see. Then I will take my leave for now. There are other matters which require my attention. She sounds so salty. You may kind of make you look like an evil jester. Thank you. This is the start of my villain origin story. Story. This is how it begins. Can, can I? I just look. I I know they want me to go elsewhere right now, but like. What if I went back into their home and, and, and spoke to everybody? What if I just put salt on the wound some more? What if I just... What if I... Are you guys waiting here because you knew I would fucking come back? What's going on here? <laughs> what if I just went and, and, and spoke to everybody real quick? Are they even in here? They are not. They are somewhere mourning. What do they say? This is a black day? It is. It is. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a very fucking sad day. Yep. Yep. I'm sorry, I know you have me too bad. Yeah, I know it's really hard. I'm so sorry, I don't know what I was thinking. I'm so sorry, I'm just gonna leave right now. It's okay. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> he wouldn't want you to be a villain. I know. He would want me to do the right thing. What even is the right thing? I don't know. I'm just gonna go on a slaughtering spree. The smell better I can't, my eyes are so blurry. I don't know what they're saying. <laughs> the Enterprise is at our disposal. Good. Hi, Tiro. Yeah, what if this is the part where I just stop playing Final Fantasy? <laughs> I, I just, I never played this game anymore. This is it. 
I cannot believe that they killed him. I can't believe- No, you know what? I should have seen it coming. He was too PMA. He was too nice. Yoshi P knew. He was like, we gotta kill this man. <laughs> He's too sweet. We gotta make everybody sob. Uh. Well, he's gonna go speak to Tataru. I wanna come too, bitch. What the fuck? Don't leave me. <laughs> Watch me make that my Discord status. I fucking will. Don't doubt me. Stop it! Chad, stop saying that! Stop saying that line! Okay, I know it's just over there, so I'll just, I'll just walk over. I was playing uh, for a while during the first death in a Realm Reborn. I don't even remember who dies. In I honestly don't even remember a Realm Reborn. I was the wrong way. God, fuck me. Then it's just a Dark Knight? Yes! Exactly! Exactly! See, you get it. Oh, man. Better. Everyone in the Phantom cries in that scene? Good. That's grim. Good. That does make me feel better. I would have to fight everybody if they didn't cry during that scene. Do it? Is that part of Pepper's lore? Is that- is that part of my lore? Pepper goes Dark Knight mode? <laughs> Sadness is tales of loss and fire and faith. It's all coming together, Sarnix. It's all coming together. Hello, Cassette Blue. You know, I don't think swell is the word. Oh, yeah. I have to be like level 54 or something, right? Um, I don't think swell is actually the word that I would use to describe how I'm feeling um, right now. But, you know, we can- we can go with that. It was a paladin though too? Stop. Does that mean I'm gonna have to go become a paladin in his honor? Take up the sword and shield? Oh no, Syra. Ben, do not look at me. Ben. Do not say a word. Say nothing. Yeah, I don't know if it's gonna let me do that as a Dark Knight. I could quickly do some leveling though. <sighs> I'm just thinking about it before I sleep. I'm so sorry. I love you. <laughs> Good night, Benjamin. <laughs> okay. We're going, going on a ship. Or we're going on a trip in my favorite rocket ship. <laughs> We're fine. Everything is fine. Everything is dandy. Just another day in the life of me. The cock cocoa. <laughs> I'm not getting my cock cocoa. I don't get my cock To the northern reaches of the Sea of Clouds, where countless isles yet remained uncharted. In search of a mysterious land known as Azizla, and the unmasked Azizla. villain who sought to claim its secrets. There's a side quest that unlocks after main story quest progress to the foretold manner that you'd probably be interested in. I, you, th yes, I will do every single quest that they want me to do. Oh, look at my Oblivious girl. to the new threat which followed in their wake, they came. <laughs> it's okay, Ben. You all knew it was coming. We all knew. Oh, and you know what? You know what my phone screen is? Look at that! That shield is shattered now! <laughs> I have 
to text my friend. Where's Siobhan? Fucking died. Protecting me. <laughs> oh, I gotta take an obligatory selfie real quick. To send her. That's a bad one, hold on. There we go. <laughs> this game needs to come <laughs> this game needs to come with free therapy. You're fucking right. Yeah, I can't take it. I'm too low. Four fifty seven? Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go back to summoner. Cause she's sixty one. Okay, y'all, how many more quests are in Heaven's Ward? Because I think this <laughs> this might be where I end the stream. I don't know. I really, 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 really want to keep playing. There's a lot more. I have a long way to go. Wow. Really fucking glad they didn't end it on that note. Um. <laughs> There's a lot? Well, you got to the vault way faster than I thought. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just kind of like, I'm only just doing like MSQ, right? So. Man. I'm gonna post Heaven's War? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know what? We'll do a little bit more. We'll do a little bit more. Yeah, the X packs are really fucking long. That I know. I know, they're like crazy. Um, I'm gonna change my minion. What do I change it to? I'm gonna change it to a puppy. I'm gonna change it to a little puppy. What's the next. What's the next called? It's called. Um, uh, familiar faces. Oh man. Send a container of worship on live in denial. I, um, seem to have beat you to the punch. <laughs> there is absolutely a chance that I already did that many moons ago. <laughs> Okay, so these are there's 26 more quests left. Okay, yeah, so I'll know once I start hitting the level 60 class. Okay, that checks out. No fucking way. How do I? No shit. How do I? Chat. 
chat 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 can that's Kurthus uh Airship landing? That's where I'm going. Isn't that- wait, no. Isn't it like over here? It's like- it's like right over there, right? Right? Or is it by the Sky Steel Manufactory? Down the stairs? Babes, there are a lot of stairs here. There are a ton of stairs here. You gotta be a little bit more specific. I found it. Is it this? Did I make it? I don't think I made it. I don't think this is the one. This is not the one. This is not it. I'm gonna fucking jump. The other one? What other one? Cometh here, Star Next, where are you? Where are you? Where am I comething? Oh, there you are. I think that's you. Is that you? That is you. <gasps> Do I go this way? Oh, bless. 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 Bl Other one, my bad. <laughs> All this because I wanted to show that I had him as my thingy ma bobber. Uh Good night, son. Take care. I am too emotionally distraught for this. I'm very, very sad right now. I don't really know what to do. This is oddly hilarious, though. <laughs> Just read looks at Suta, looks at Syra. Oh no. <sighs> yeah. 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 That happened. And, um. Well. I don't need any of you. I am a god! I am a god! It was the random cat girl or cat boy! I don't know what they were! Oh. Yeah, I, um, I got really excited playing the game because, you know, my boy Orange Font kept popping up and the story was really good. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to play more Heaven's Word because I want to be with my boy. <laughs> and look at how they massacred my boy. I 
I got baited so hard. I got baited so hard. <sighs> oh, it's a duty? Oh, no one else can be with me. Well, goodbye. You like my heavens where problem looks are? It's a nice shield. Fuck you, Jay. I hate you. I even fucking complimented. I was like, wow, it's Orshifon's shield. You were probably giggling away in your little seat in your dark little condo, just like, <laughs> I know. I, I can't trust anyone anymore. I'm not going to fall in love with any other character. You forgot to talk to him the last time, too, right? Shh. It's not that deep. I don't talk to the NPCs anyway. It's fine. Chat told me what he said. It was something corny as always. It's fine. It is what it is. I, my therapist is going to be fucking stoked to hear about this one. If you want, I can hurt you more. Jay, you already hurt me. I don't need more. I don't need more pain from you. <laughs> no, do it. Unleash your best or your worst. I don't. What are they doing to the Vanu? Oh no, they're trembling. His seat shall always remain at. Jay? 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 I can never do that. <laughs> no, 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 no. Jay's back, unfortunately. He had it coming. He knew. He knew it was coming. It was a worthy sacrifice. I may be way too emotionally drained for this. There is a slim chance that I am way, way too drained for this. Oh shit, I was like, why isn't my attack going off? I just zoned out to look at Elf, you know.
<laughs> been saving the notification for when I needed it. Jay, thank you for the three month resub with your Prime. I appreciate it. <sighs> My internet went out. What did I miss? Well, Jay got banned for being the worst friend that I've ever had in my entire life. Rubbing salt on my wounds like it was nobody's business. It's always nice seeing one of the most memorable moments for a first time in this game. So fun to watch first playthroughs. So you just like pain. Huh? Are you a masochist? Because same, I guess. Okay. Alright, it's Lord Manu. I cried so much too. Good. Okay. He he should not have died like that. I cannot I honestly I I can believe that they killed him off. Like it does check out, but like I cannot believe it. You know what I mean? I cannot believe they killed him off. And they killed him off so nobly too. He always talks about like honor and like dying for a good cause and like all this bullshit. So it's like, dude, like of course that's how you die. You die like it's ah! I can't find the words right now. I'm just fucking sad. I am sad. And my therapist is gonna laugh so hard at me, but it's okay. He died for me. capacity to deal with you right now. <laughs> Davy, why did you make me cry again? <laughs> the shield of Ishgard, you retweeted the peace day too. I know, and it's because of Davy. She sent me it, and I was like, oh wow, look, he's my boy. Oh, my boy looks so cute. And now that peace has a whole other meaning because he's gone. <laughs> okay. Good night, Sarnix. Thanks for hanging and helping with um the dungeons and stuff. I appreciate it. Oh, the flying whale! I fucking forgot about that! I completely forgot about the whole flying whale plot. Oh, and when I... That is... Yeah, and when I had to, like, save... Or, or Chiffon's like younger brother or whatever and then he came and helped us <laughs> oh someone said hungry hungry hippo god damn all right chat um I'm going to go to the etherite, and then I'm going to hop off for the night. I am heartbroken. I am so... Well, first let me go collect the goods. I am so heartbroken. I am so sad. I don't know what to do. I'm scared to keep playing, because I'm almost certain... I am certain there's gonna are you fucking kidding me? There's gonna be some funeral thing and I gotta go and it's gonna be sad and I'm gonna cry. Alright. I'm just gonna should I skip it? I'm I can't read it. I can't and I'm locked in it now. You're coming such of an airship. Yeah, yeah. I just need hugs. Just give me my little hugs. Welcome to Final Fantasy XIV after ARR. Yeah, it fucking sucks here, man. <laughs> oh 
Rust is very good, yeah. I don't think I'm going to be streaming tomorrow. I think tomorrow I'm going to be taking a day off. Um, and Friday I'm playing games with J3. Um, and I know it's at like 9 p.m. Eastern, so it's going to be in his stream. So I may be live early that day. Um, and Saturday I'm busy, so I might be taking a little bit of time off from streaming again. But, I mean, I'll be back with the Final Fantasy shenanigans at some point. You can actually rewatch cutscenes if you go to the end. Yeah, I, I know that you can do that. Um, I'm not going to. I don't think I ever want to relive that cutscene. Ever. Um, yeah, let me attune real quick. And then I'm going to hop off. I literally thought for some reason I was about to plummet to my demise. But I know better. This game doesn't have... It has, like, invincible walls. All right. A day off tomorrow is very convenient after how tonight went down. Well, who knows? I may be lying. I may hop on really, really early. I may hop on super de duper de duper de duper early. Um, I have a couple friends coming over, so that's why I was like, oh yeah, probably not gonna be live. But then they're coming over at five, so I may be able to do like an afternoon stream. I don't know. All right, chat. Thank you for the 50 bits, Anonymous Cheerer. I could turn on my alerts again. Rock in the ears, hope you're having a blast. Do I look like I'm having a blast? Take one good look at me. Is this the face of somebody who's having a blast? Hold on, let me just, because I don't have the um, thingy majiggy, let me just. <laughs> this was a great deeply impactful stream this definitely was <laughs> uh, do I have face wipes here let me see I don't think I do yeah I don't I don't yeah alright so I gotta go wash my face Hope you hydrate. Oh, don't worry. I have been hydrating. All right, chat. Thank you for hanging out with me. This has been... This has been a stream. I had a lot of fun binge playing uh, Final Fantasy Online tonight and, like, afternoon and whatnot. That was really fun. I definitely think I'm going to be doing that more often. So you can probably expect a lot of sporadic uh, Final Fantasy Online streams. I did notice that a lot of my viewers actually do like it when I stream earlier. I did not know that. So I'm going to try my best to actively get on at um, earlier hours. Uh, sorry for your loss. Yeah, thanks. Um, but yeah. Thank you, everybody. Don't forget to hang out with me in my Discord server and follow me on social media. That way you can stay up to date with all of my shenanigans. I will catch you all in another stream. Bye!